Ladies and gentlemen, we are currently starting the third annual bi-weekly Jads Fighting Game Guilty Gear Strive Tournament Leo Downplay Edition. Let us change the uh, sound settings so we get some beautiful lobby music. Anyway... Scuffed? What do you mean scuffed? This is this is beautiful. Anyway, let's let's take a look at our bracket screen. Here we have a little miniature thing in the bottom right, so I can't I can't mess up again. Beautiful. Um, so anyway, let's see what is it to ha go. First up, we have Woman Sexer versus. Bloopy, who will win this tournament of champions? Going into game number one already, we have Woman Sexer as the chip versus Ramlafall Bloopy. Let's see who will win. Mankind knew that. 
Duel one. Okay, going into game number one. We have Chip jumping in. Goes straight for the 2D into a DP. Amazing confirmed. Definitely what he intended to do. Ramped up again. Goes for the throw. In the corner from Scram. What are you gonna do? Daru, that's a punish. Rekka's. Jumping in. Slashes. Can you keep up? Chip with the random super. Run up random super. What a godlike play. That was a that was an amazing read. Oh, and Baloopy goes for the random super, but the Alpha Blade cross up doesn't get hit by it. So smart. Just pressing buttons. Goes for the overhead, but the fuzzy jump catches it. Up gets hit by the Daru. Chip jumping in. Jump back by the Ram. Ram goes through the throw. In the corner versus Ram. This is probably dead if he can convert it. No, not dead. Probably would have died with the super. But the anti air 2H takes the round. Sick anti air. Solid round by Baluki. Kind of Getting record. Challenges him with the two uh with the 5k. Thirst going out. Ram. Ram is taking a solid lead in this uh, first game. The blue RC comes in to punish the uh, whip command grab, but Bloopy goes in with the Bloopy special of the random super on the drop combo. Amazing play by Bloopy there, going up 1-0 against Woman Zexer. Woman Sexy does not seem to be too happy about that with the uh, the multiple question marks. Going into game number two, Woman Sexy versus Bloopy. Bloopy has the uh, the ten wins versus the chip badge, so clearly Bloopy knows this matchup very well. Let's rock. Going into game number two, Bloopy trying to start off with six P. But he doesn't quite get it. Watch out. He gets fighting himself out the corner, but Women's Sexy goes in with the uh, burst. Shut it down. Oh, miss input with Beta Blade. <laughs> the random super catches him again. Oh, no. Oh, no, Women's Sexy. That is not Startup Invincible. Already tilted by the random supers by Bloopy. He's just got blockers, Bloopy, sometimes. 6P catching the uh, follow-up swings. Good anti air with jump back slash by Luffy. Comes up, but gets hit by the Beta Blade punish. Alpha Blade in the air. And the Chip Vortex. Just people jumping around right now. Gotta watch out. Oh, that was a super! Woman Sexer actually blocked that, but the miss input. That was that was a that was a failed super. The clap the, the wake up ram classic of throwing the high sword. Which the grab but only goes for the two uh Martin does and misses with the jump back. Goes for the overhead once again. Chip doing chip things, getting the walls spot. Getting the wall break. Oh that is a lot of damage. Half of half of her health is off. Secure. Gotta watch out for the first in the corner versus Chip. Damn the blade. Tried to bait out something there, but Bloopy didn't have meter to super, so I don't know why he didn't just go in. First in the fire, see, but you're in the corner versus Ram, and he just throws swords at you and takes the game. Bloopy going up 2 0 versus Chip. Woman sexer. This is your matchup. What are you doing? Chip's H super is fully invincible? No, it's not. I'm almost positive it's not. Good check, dust loop. Going into game number three. Can Woman Sexer make a comeback from the loopy? Game number three. Let's rock. 
So we jump again, goes into the Rekkas, but the gold upper goes out. Loopy has a lot of meter to work with. You need to be very careful because he's a best super! Okay. Oh, this is a lot of damage. Oh, that was a drop combo, but it doesn't matter because he gets hit by the sword anyway. Loopy has a severe life advantage and a lot of meter and goes for the big, big old slash. Probably was gonna, uh, probably gonna RC that, regardless if it hit or not. Jumping in. Blocks the, uh, Dawn Charge Dust. Here's the throw! Beta Blade gets him out of, gets him out of there. Ooh. Good punish. Five, Loopy. Rekkas? Running up. Gotta be careful. He's gotta block this. Oh no! Flippin' Sexer! Oh no! Flippin' Sexer! So the PCD gets him out of there, but he tries with a super, but miss input once again! RC? Good block by Wolven Sexer. Seeing that the BRC was coming out. He has burst. Oh, and the super! And he take and Wolf Sexer takes the round. Is this the comeback we've all been anticipating? Rekka's. That like cross up, crossed up. There's no justice in this world, and because of that, Wolf Sexer is down half his health. And positive bonus by Ramp, and he has so much meter. Gotta be careful. Gotta be careful. Because you know Bloopy is mashing that super as much as possible. Well, that's punishable, but you need got you need to be better at punishing that. And Bloopy takes it in convincing 3-0 against Woman Sexer, sending Woman Sexer to loser's bracket. Switch to the uh screen. Up next. We have Sarath versus Damsung. Check pins for the room code. Yeah, the Ram, Ram's uh, Ram Super is uh, pretty good. It's hard to it's hard to get a big punish off of it, but it definitely is punishable. Wow, game window is there when you show the brackets? So professional. Th thank you. I'm I'm a professional streamer, and this is the most professional fighting game tournament. Less technical difficulties than Evo. You're waiting for Sarah. To arrive. Both, both, and both people are here. So let's see. Going in to game number one: Ding Ding Sun versus Sarah. Sarah, the birthday boy. Oh my God, that is a lot of points. Level eight hundred and seventy-three. Faust versus a Tao. Who will win in this Faust versus a Tao? Mankind knew that they cannot change society. So instead of reflecting on themselves, they blame the beasts. Heaven or hell. Playing the intro rock. Respectable. I'm here to scout you. No need for insurance. Faust. Faust. Versus Zato. Game number one, Duel Faust versus Zato. Let's rock. It's a Tau. No. Jump in. Getting stabbed with a scalpel. Eddie coming out, Eddie pressure. You're stuck in the Eddie mix up. But he bursts out after Eddie is over. Questionable burst since the uh, mix up was pretty, pretty much over since uh, the Eddie gate was empty. Fousting. Trumpet coming out. Oh, tries to shimmy him, but not. This isn't Street Fighter V. You can't just shimmy like that. Oh, sweet. Mix 
mix mix, that's punishable, but the RC comes out. And the Zato blocks him. Catches him in the air with the bag, and then he just blocks it. For some reason, the bag hits uh, Faust as well. Losing your turn versus Faust uh, versus Zato. Big damage! And takes it in a game number one, going to Sarah. Frog coming out, and Zato's done. Mix, mix, mix got blocked, but no punish coming up from Zato. Uh, Catches the scalpel. Block screen coming out, but gets a uh, hit. Eddie is down, but bursts out to get out of there. Mix, mix, is there a punish? No, just a, just a jab to get him off of him. Running up, but the uh, wake up throw. Goldberg's coming out. Oh, the big, big items coming out. Bomb, watch out for the bombs, don't press buttons. Oh no, Zatsu just took half his health because he didn't block the bombs. Mix, mix, mix coming out, but that's punishable. But no punish coming out, and the dive kick coming out for his foul. Dual three. Round three. Any pressure? Frog. Mix, mix, mix. No punish, unfortunately. I don't know if, uh, if Zato can get a big punish over that or not. Hit some with the scalpel. Uh, no just frame, unfortunately. RC made the burst. He just has a sliver left. And the uh, Scarecrow coming out to take game number one for Dang, uh, Dang Song. Damn Song. It's currently 1 0 Faust for Sato. from the Zato mix-up. Gets him with the snip, snip, snip. He has an afro. Is he gonna go for the overhead? Goes for the overhead, but he blocks it. Zato gets out of the corner. Gets a hammer. Good 6P to get Zato out of the air. Hits him with the low. That second heavy of the 2K hits him low. Not the first hit for some reason. Tries for the overhead. Mix, mix, mix. RC is the instant overhead. And then goes straight for the command grab. Wake up command grab by Zato. Gets him to use the burst, which is good, good, uh, pretty good for Zato since it was unlikely he would have made the comeback anyway. At least he got the burst out. Gets Zato out of the air. There's a bag bomb. XP. Zato mix up. Ooh, caught him pressing buttons. Bag. Bag. The Krausling. He's coming! Oh no. Krausling get kills Eddie. It's unfortunate. Burst out of the Scarecrow. Super, but that's gonna be blocked. Um, unless he doesn't block. He tries to go up with the man grab, but uh, Krauss grabs him out. RC. Into the overhead. Goes low this time to the command grab, and then hits him with the 5 H to take game number two. Samsung showing very strong Faust play in this round one. We have three Fausts in this tournament. We have four Fausts in this tournament. Yeah, all these all these uh, tier whores playing top tier at Faust. Notice how there are no Leos in this tournament because Leo is a low tier character. Um, no one plays him because he's so bad. It's very Duel sad. One. Let's rock. Ooh, runs up from the close slash. I would have expected the uh the uh foul special going for the command crowd, but the uh the army is coming. Except for the overhead. Gets out of the corner. Now he's in the 
It's also a mix up, but he whips the command grab. Pose. Trying to go in when he doesn't have Eddie Gage. Draw coming in. Stabbed in him. Doesn't quite get the frame trap, and he finally jumps out of there to stay safe. Mix, mix, mix. I don't know if that would side that hit. Probably not. Anybody smash right now? The one hit will do it. Goes for the stab and then hits him with a 5 age when you try to anti air it. When he goes for the scalpel, you can uh, reaction 6 P it. You get a knockdown. Uh, Pressure. From behind. The frog catches him when he whips the throw. Yeah, but the, you know, watch out for the jump in. Pass is gonna dive kick into you if he keeps throwing those out. Super Eddie is up, but he bursts out of there. No Eddie gauge for the moment. Oh, gets the jump in, but gets hit by the throw. Goes to the overhead. Ooh, goes for the shimmy. And then burst bait. That's a wall break right there. Oh, super! I have not seen uh, this wall break super before. I did a lot of damage. Sorry. Can be my mic in time. Zato taking the round. Duel three. Tournament point once again. Oh, not tournament point, but uh, a set point. Heavy pressure. Frog coming out. Goes for the median instead of the throw this time. Cancels the pose, gets hit with the frog. This is a lot of damage. Super? No super. He doesn't have any gauge coming in. Tries to catch a back dash, but not quite. Gets hit by the scalpel while he tries to uh, go back. Goes low into the mix 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 right away. Goes low once again. Oh no, the uh, Scarecrow RC. Gets the overhead. Overhead once again, any hit will take it. Uh, and the mix 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 will chip him out. And Damn Song will take the set. 3 0. Sending Sarah to the loser's bracket. Showing Fal everybody that Faust is top tier. <laughs> Up next, we have Maddie versus uh, Shivabra. I am pretty sure that's not how you spell it, say it, pronounce it. Shivabra says, give me a minute. Oh, dude, we have a Faust mirror match? Oh, man. Coming up. Faust mirror match. Fortunately, Shivabra needs a little bit of time uh, to get, get set, situated. In the meantime, how's everybody doing today? How's the tournament so far? Any comments about uh, audio balancing, uh, game balancing, Milia top tier, low tier, Leo good, bad, probably bad. Everybody thinks he's bad. That's why no one plays him. One thing to one thing to keep in mind against uh, is Fa uh, against Faust is a lot of his uh, special follow ups are punishable in some way. So if he does the if he does the big big scalpel thing, you can, can pretty much consistently six p it unless you have the Afro on you. Um, if he goes for mix mix mix, blocking will it leads to that being punishable, and then the uh, item throw you can normally just like run up and hit him before he's done. Here we go. Shvabra has entered the room. 
Only. Is this is this not a uh, Faust mirror match? And Shivabra went to the dark side. Anyway, we're going into game number one. Shivabra has gone to the dark side. We are Maddie versus Shivabra. Man, Faust like versus May. Dual one. This is a very May favorite match in my opinion. May can just jump in at him, maul him in the corner. Hits him with the air to air, but the anvil saved him from any follow up. Hits him with the overhead. Jumps in, but doesn't quite connect. Flip it too early on the jump page. Back kick. Hits him out of the air. Goes for the far slash, and. No follow up. How did he not get hit by that jump slash when he went charged in? The corner versus May getting hit by dolphins and the anti air far slash will take the round. Dual two. Just 60 dolphins. Like a boss. As not good advice. Was Faust. Oh, that is a lot of damage. Faust getting balled. Kind of hit. RC. This is probably a wall break. Oh my god, that damage. Sababra taking a convincing game number one while I'm at May. Balling the poor Faust in the corner. This is this is like the anime where where the where the main where the evil protag antagonist like uh, antihero gives in to the evil powers to beat the protagonist Faust. But this is an anime. This is Guilty Gear, and the evil the evil antagonist will win this time by giving in to the evil powers of the May. Get some out of the air with the uh, go slash. Scarecrow, that's super punishable. Catches the back dash. That wasn't a combo. Watch out for the bomb! Got to get hit by the bomb. Swim punk, kick it away. Jumping in once again, it hits him with the air throw! Oh my god, the disrespect. I mean, Guilty Gear is pretty anime? I mean, I guess. Corner. Quick jumping. That was left in the air. Stretch the overhead, but gets Dolphin. Oh, this is a lot of damage. Oh my god, what happened to this? How was that hit coming out? Oh, no, uh, S Dolphin follow up. Hits him out of the air. That would have been like 50%. Combo as well. And May, Shivabra taking it 2 0 convincingly against Maddie. Can the Faust make the comeback? Fight the evil anime demon that is May. See how it goes. It's a potentially the final uh, game of the set. Strikes him out. Ooh. Just barely doesn't put them with the uh, put the back bombs them both away. Far slash. Dolphins. Ooh, runs up for the commando but gets XP out of there. RC but not red RC, so the combo doesn't follow up. Much mix, 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 but not hard enough to punish. Not close enough to punish, I mean. Watch out for the meteors! Well, I I don't know what just happened in that interaction, but that's pretty much every Faust interaction. Maddie, striking back, believing in the power of friendship and anime and the Bagman. Overhead, running up, goes to overhead again, but gets jumped in on dolphins. Oh my god, what happened to his health? Just May things, doing May things. Far slash. Takes the ground. Set point. Bush of Abra. Gets him out of the scarecrow. First! Counter hit. Oh, but no Dolphin follow up. Didn't have charge in time. Dolphin. Dolphin. Hit some RC. Big damage. 
Oh my god. Poor Mouse. Box overhead, but no special follow-up, so that's punishable. And catches him in the air with the two, a jump 2 H, taking the game in a convincing 3 0. Shiv Apra continuing on with to winner's bracket, Maddie getting sent to the losers. Switch the bracket screen. Up next, we have Pikachu versus Moro. Piacha. Piacha. It's Piacha, right? Milia Pot. As we all know, top tier Milia versus garbage character Potemkin. Who will take it? I believe both people are here. Vapper, sorry about what he did to Maddie. Killing a house, ma'am. It's like it's like killing a unicorn. Sometimes you gotta put it down. Anyway, we're going into game number one. Piaja versus Moro, Amelia versus Pot. A very uh, pot favorite matchup. Amelia has to play flawlessly and not ever make any mistake, otherwise Amelia just dies. Let's rock. Two H or two D. Side head. That is minus when you when he does it that far. Leaves her out of the air. The corner. Back Mega Fist catches her. Approach. Good anti air on the uh, bug stomp. H disc catches him in the air. This is a lot of damage. Going straight into the super. Okay, where's the mix going? Runs up and rolls. Catches it, trying to go for the pop buster, but no RC. Make it safe. Oh, back Mega Fist catches the jump in. Oh, and he pressed the button on the meaty Garuda. Ooh, rough. Dual two. Let's rock. Ooh, catches the Mega Fist. Forward Mega Fist. Forward Mega Fist once again, trying to anti hair her. Back dash is the uh, H Disc, but no follow up conversion. H Disc. Where's the mix going? Empty jump low. Goes for the. Goes for high. Low again. The air goes straight for the Potemkin Buster. Slaps her out of the air. Get out of here! Ooh, RC to catch the uh, Hammer Ball. Goes low. I thought she was gonna go for the tick throw right there. So she goes for the car slash. Or the 5H. And the Gruner versus Potemkin. Flicks. And she's out of there. Side head catches her. She's negative. Compressed buttons versus that. Does Maddie cut him? H disc goes for the cross up. No burst. Goes for the empty jump low. H disc into just blocking. So smart. Great play coming in from Kaija here. Megapist. She's in the air, but it was a trade. Air car. Goes for the overhead, but doesn't connect. Missed it just a little. Oh, went for the hammer ball. Random hammer ball to beat the higher car. Goes for the double overhead. Great blocks by Moro there. Overhead, overhead, low. Gets hit by the second low. H disc. Back Mega Fist catches it. It's not quite meaty. It's unusual. By that I mean jumping around. Oh, and Moro goes with a hammerfall RC and just smacks her out of there. Get out of here. Moro going up 1 0 versus Paija. The back of my hand hurt. hurt. I, I did not mean to slap my hand that hard. Ow. Anyway, can Paija make the adjustment? Will, Mo will Moro just keep doing Temkin things and just keep pressing Mega Fist? Anyway, we're going in game number two. 
Paisha versus Moro. If you're if you're a Milia believer, please please press one. Duel if you're one. a Milia down player, press two. Paisha is very scared of the jump backs, so she hasn't been gone. She hasn't gone for the, uh, her, Sorry, Paisha hasn't gone for the throw yet. Cross up, low, H disc, back, Mega Fist because it's not quite mini. Ahead. Negative, but he gets scooped, hug, and goss anyway. That is a lot of damage to take. Catches her in the air with the jump key. Manages. Poor Megfest is trying to catch a backdash. Gets hit by the hammer fall with the 2 8 or 2k or 2k. Trip to get her out of there. And you hit will take it. After after getting hit by that uh that hammer ball, or after getting hit by the slide head, if uh if Potemkin goes for the very far hammer fall, you you are a very plus on that, so you can challenge pretty much anything he can do. So that's just a little bit of magic knowledge in, in that case. What Potemkin wants you to do, he's, he wants to put the fear of God into you. So he he wants you to be scared and wants you to backdash. Because that way he can, you know, beat you with pretty much any button. Duel 1. Let's rock. Go for the air grab, a hard read. Air card gonna go to the other side. Each disc goes for the cross up. Gets him in the air. No slash. Goes for the hair card, but that's punishable, but more doesn't get the punish. Because he just punished it with the, uh. The pop bus. He catches him in the air, but no follow up conversion. Got TK Bad Moon. Oh. So hard. Getting caught in the million mix. First, before the wall break happened. Goes for the, off goes for the wake up super. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Did that just happen? What the fuck? <laughs> anyway, moving on. I. That was. <laughs> so, anyway, we have a game going on. I completely forgot the score. Set point for Moro. Anyway, Millie doing Millie things. The hair card doesn't go quite high enough. Goes with double overhead, but gets grabbed out of it. Giddy Garuda bursts out of there. Random hair card, RC. Just overheading to the tick throw. Page disc. Let's get to anti air with the random or with the air dashes. Trying to throw the empty jump below, but quite a bit too slow for that. Gets grabbed out of it instead. Just follow up on the uh, 2D. Back Mega Fest catches her. And he hit will take it and the Hammerfall takes the round. And the set. Moro. 3 0 versus Paija. Paija getting sent to loser's bracket. Millie Believers in shambles. Unfortunate. Anyway. That uh. Someone needs to clip that, uh, that Heavenly Potemkin Buster, because that was amazing. Uh, up next, we have Finn, the Triangle Enthusiast, versus Bloopy in Winner's Bracket. Yeah, that, ma that matchup is pretty bad for Milia. It's unfortunate. Millie has to do a lot of really unsafe things, and Potemkin only needs to guess like once or twice. I feel like I feel like Moro was listening in when I said that was negative, and the only time he didn't press buttons was the time that you did super. It's all rigged. 
commentator ruining the game for the uh, contestants. Finn, I don't remember who he plays versus Peter. Uh, waiting for Finn. Finn says, uno secundo, secundo. For you, for you who don't know, uh, who don't know French, that means, uh, I need a little bit more time. I don't know what Finn plays either. I got a request from Jack Chan saying that he will be a little bit late, so I will, when we get to his match versus Moro, I will uh, delay it as long as possible. If not, I will have to, uh, I will have to DQ uh, Jack Chan. But he should be here in time. So how's everybody doing? How's the tournament so far? Who is your favorite to win this tournament? Let's hear your voice now. Personally, I want, uh... I want Millie to win. Just so that I can downplay Leo more. Not enough Faust players? There are three Faust players. And there would've been four if you weren't a, if you weren't a traitor. Fabra the traitor. Where's the stream at? I'm not a traitor? You are a traitor! The Faust Coalition required your 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 trust. And you went with the demon instead. Why couldn't you pick Instead of instead of picking like a low tier like Leo, you had to pick a top tier like May. Likely story. I, I know your first character was Mei. I played your Mei in a first to ten when I first got the game. And we went even. Oh no, I think Bloopy is still AFK. Okay. That's good, he didn't, he didn't sign up right away. So it looks like Finn is here, but we are waiting for Bloopy. For Bloopy Rage Quit. We tried to wake up super in real life, but then, uh, but then died. It's unfortunate. are waiting for Bloopy to return. Mm. 
May is cute? You guys suck. I didn't know you were into like literal hellspawn. So yeah, I guess I guess I guess she's cute. You know who is very cute? Leo. Bottom tier character. Only only true true people of tastes play such a such a bad character like Leo. And we are back! Bloopy versus Finn, Ramlethal versus Eno. It's the first time on the Jabs Tournament stage we have seen Finn on the I know. Mankind knew that they cannot. A uh, no. One. Let's rock. With the uh, with the drip Eno skin. I have no idea who wins this matchup. I assume I Eno just does Eno things and uh. Loopy does loopy things. Good block on the overhead, but gets hit by the uh, stroke. And jump into super command grab. So smart. That is a lot of damage. I think she's dead. Oh my god. What happened to his health bar? It evaporated. The jumping in, tried to go for the run up throw. He's hit out of the air with that 6 H. That move is uh, pretty nutty. Damage goes low. Empty jump low. Zenfud doesn't quite get the combo. Brain trap. And Eno taking convincing game number one. Finn the triangle enthusiast. Except Eno plays a guitar. Should be uh, Finn the guitar enthusiast. I can't believe F Bloopy is fucking dead. Yeah, that that command grab does does a lot of damage. Thing about the thing about Eno is uh, a lot of her pressure is very unsafe and loses to jabs. But it's hard to it's hard to like think about how to fight her. I play Leo, so I just DP. So I don't know how to fight, you know? I just, uh, I just DP. Loopy gets hit. Got it. In the corner versus Loopy. Ooh, gets caught, but bursts him out. That is very scary to do versus Ram. In the air. He goes high that time. Big damage. Wall break combo. He's gonna go for the safe jump. Oh, he doesn't know the safe jump. Or didn't want to go for the safe jump. I would have gone for the safe jump and just baited the, the super by Loopy. Catches him in the air with Eno super. That Eno super is very strong. Even on block, it, even on block, that second hit is like plus 30 or something crazy. Hits him with the third hit of the Rekka with no meter. That is uh, some craziness. Oh! And he goes for the two hits of the Rekka into the super. But Finn is not is not a is not falling for that. Catch him in the air. Still in the corner. Whips the throw, but no punish coming out. Meaty note. Goes for the meaty note into command grab super. That is so scary. My god. And he is dead! Oh my lord. His his health bar. What happened to his health bar? Finn up 2-0 versus Bloopy. Eno has the strongest supers in the game? 100% true. Eno's, Eno's reversal super is, is crazy good. Eno's super uh, confirming from the air, it's like a red RC. Duel except better. Luffy does a sword, but uh, Eno got out by uh, the lightning slide away. Goes low. So press buttons after the uh, a slash, but you're pretty negative. He jumps over, just barely jumps over the note. Does the air super? Catches him. One tap, confirm into the super by Bloopy. 
Goes for the double overhead to take the round. Set point for Finn. Dual two. Let's rock. Taking the blow. The double overhead. Jump. Has to jump into the regular throw. Hi. That's true. Catches him in the air with a 6P. Ooh, what? What was he trying to do there? I guess that was a wake up super. Gotta wait. Watch out for the wake up super, Bloopy. Catches him with the, uh, the classic uh, ram jump P wall break combo. RC. It should be. But no, he drops the combo, but it doesn't matter because he throws a sword anyway. Dual 3. Let's rock. Ooh, runs up through the uh, chemical laws. First out there. Catches him with the swords, and that's a wall break. Some full stream. Ramlethal doing Ramlethal things. Hits him with the hard and heavy stroke. Big damage coming in from Eno. Goes for the wake up super through the note? What? What is that range? Excuse me? Excuse me. I'm sorry, but did that have like max full screen range super? Just rambles all things. Anyway, the score is 2 1. Finn versus Bloopy. Bloopy coming back. I don't know what the hell that was. That was some bullshit. Duel 1. Let's rock. And gets hit by the star slash. Take it. Take it. Just throw it on Bloopy has a lot of meter. Oh, Bloopy tried to super there. Bloopy did super there! Oh, miss uh, the close slash, meaty. It's up in the air, but good, uh, good fuzzy jump. RC, but first out of there. Stay safe. Watch out for the heavy stroke! Ooh, you could grab that. That was, that was telegraph from a mile away. When Eno is pretty far away, uh, she typically goes for a heavy slash to keep the pressure up, so you need to be aware of that. It's kind of like Leo, where you can throw it on reaction. Ramp gets caught. Big damage, but drops the combo, but it doesn't matter because it catches them anyway. One more hit. Hi. Oh, he's scared of the super. First him and get out of there. Ooh, catches him in the air. But he wakes up super. Bloopy's gonna wake up super. RC! Bloopy! Come on, RC! You have the meter! Bloopy! Bloopy, please! Anyway. Finn, on the Eno, takes it 3-1 versus Bloopy. I was a, that was a very telegraph super. Because uh, Ram had the meter. To RC it, but Bloopy didn't RC it. Fortunate. Anyway, up next we have someone new. PW2, PWTO versus Damsung on the Faust. Faust Gaming. How do you say? I regret that super in, at the end a lot. It was a good, uh, honestly, that was a good super because you had a uh, you had meter. You would have won the round. You would have won the game, and you would have been at an advantage. That was a good super. It's just you didn't RC it at the end. Anyway, it looks like our combatants are up! Is this a- is this a Kai- Kai Gaming? We have... I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna call him Tio. Tio versus Damsung. Kai versus Faust. This is a pretty good matchup for Kai, in my opinion. Mankind knew Let's that see. they cannot change Going society. to game number one. Duel one. Let's rock. Counter. 
jump pack H. Random stun zippers. He loves to see it. He knows how to play Kai. Sweep gets meteors. Ooh, blocks it. Good box. Playing the lame Kai. I don't think he knows the matchup. Gets hit by the, the anvil, but the trumpet saved him. Ooh, RC. Good punish on the H fireball. You gotta watch out for Faust when he has meter. He can't throw fireballs for some then. Got the stun edge, but that is very punishable. Goes low. Gets the trumpet. RC, but he's gonna get cut by the trumpet. But gets hit by the Faustling anyway. TV, but no follow up. No punishable. Oh! RC. That was probably the wrong super. Ride the Lightning would have uh, been a lot of damage. That super is not invincible, though. I don't even know what's called, I've rarely ever seen it. He has a trumpet. The trumpet saves him from the overhead. Hammer coming in, goes low. Mix, mix, mix. That's punishable, but he RCs it. Goes for the tick throw, but this times it just a little bit. Ooh, tries to go for the meaty throw, but missed times it quite a bit. It lets Faust get out of the corner. Faust going low. First to get the save. Gets over the uh, scalpel. Ooh, a little bit. A little bit of misspacing that uh, stun zipper. Makes it punishable. And Dan uh, Damsung going up 1 0 versus Tio. In this matchup, Kai really wants to look for the 6P, because 6P beats almost all of uh, Faust's options, other than his uh, his 2H. And if uh, if Faust is going for a 2H, you can pretty you can pretty like easily uh, whip punish that. You can either whip punish it, or it's your turn after you block it. Just after the 2H, you need to watch for the scalpel. Low, low again, but mix, mix, mix. Stun dipper, go underneath the scalpel to a hard two D. Hit him with the fishing pole. Sling coming out. Got sling mad. Just got meteors. Watch out! Could have comboed if Damson was a little bit more cognizant. Goes low once again. Ooh, got RC that. And Damson taking the round. Gotta be careful throwing out the random stun dippers. If you're not spacing them properly, they don't even combo. And if you don't have and if you don't RC them, they're very punishable. It's like minus 15 or something crazy. So it makes us punishable, but unfortunately no punish. Just to jump over the scalpel. Just of jumping over the scalpel against Faust, you want to six speed the scalpel. It's hard. It's hard uh, if you're not used to doing it. But once you get it, it's up. Uh, if you once you know what to look for, it's pretty straightforward. Samsung taking game number two. I think Tio tried to go for the tried to go for a uh, a DP, but instead he got the H fireball instead. Anyway, up to zero. Didn't even know we had level 800 bounces and jads. Duel one. Let's rock. Going in game number three. Sun dippers. Play your defense over it. Oh! Vapor is rust to get out of there! Looks like 2 H, but no wood punish. Looks like Tio is not trying to challenge the uh, 2K. In this matchup, uh, uh, Kai's 2K is very strong against uh, the wood punish and all those uh, wood buttons. Mix, 
Expects the corner pressure, goes for the command grab. Punches Buggy, goes straight for the uh, first. Go ahead. And that takes the round. Set point for Damsung. That was scary. Doesn't get punished on the stun dipper though, unfortunately. Not the punish that time. Mix, mix, mix. Goes for the media low. Mix, mix once again. Good whiff punished by the Kai player. Sacred Edge. That was uh, interesting. Blue RC to get out of there. We tried to challenge with the wrong button, but RC in the air. Watch out, goes low. Mix, mix, mix. Ooh, vapor press. I'm trying to guess for something, and I think that's the game. And that's the set. Damsung going up 3 0 versus Tio. Three zero. Up next we have Sheep versus Shivabra. Because Pub is too American to play with the Japanese VA, you're goddamn right I am. You're goddamn right. Good commentary though. Pub sub has bad tastes? How dare you? Some of the English AIs are better than the Japanese ones. Don't at me, man. The Le Leo Leo VA is better in uh, English. In a uh, in Street Fighter, you can uh, change individual characters, uh, voice actors. I would probably use the uh, May Japanese voice voice actor just to tell people with the. Uh, the uh, dolphins. Hard copium. I love I love the way Kai says uh, ride the lightning in uh, in the Japanese VA. Anyway, it looks like we have Sheep and Shivabra both ready. The mirror. Oh, is this a May mirror? Are we about to see some dolphins? We are about to see some dolphins! Chivabra versus Sheep! May versus May! Ride of the lightning! Mankind knew that they can Duel 1! Chivabra in the in the purple May! Uh Sheep in the uh in the uh, red May. Ooh, good 6 p get him out of there! First the wake up! Wake up! That was a lot of damage. Good starting off for, for Shivabra. Has made her two. Dolphin into RC, and that should be the round, but he didn't have charge. Doesn't matter. May doing May things. Hitting him with the dolphins. Ooh, that was scary. He would have taken a lot of damage if he got counter hit there. First to get out of the uh, dolphin pressure. Ooh, missed times the uh, 5 HPD. Good we'll punish though. Catch him in air, but uh, unfortunately couldn't get the conversion off of it. RC off of the S dolphin. Big damage. Not quite enough to take it. Zon Silver. But catches the back dash with the S dolphin. And Shivabra taking game number one. Jellyfish. Shivabra up. 1 0. Jellyfish, more like smelly fish, because they're playing May. <laughs> Got him. Anyway, going into game number two. Man. Duel one. Let's rock. That's at the start. It's a slide. Maybe H Dolphin. Tried to counter, but uh couldn't get the conversion off. Dolphins! Dolphins! Dolphin slide! Gonna hit him with the slide again. Gotta be really careful with that slide though. It's very, very unsafe. Hit him with a 2D into Dolphin. 
Sea World, Free Willy coming on, making a cameo appearence. Catches him with far slash, but the slide taking the slide. Two. Let's catches him in the air. This is big damage. Ooh, good back dash on the slide. In the air. Frame traps. RC, but, you know, went a little bit far back. Catches him. Footsies. Chevabra. Shutting the true Street Fighter. Dolphins. 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 This is what you call high octane bay gameplay. But they go for a dolphin, and if dolphin doesn't work, they go for a jump age. Oh my god, that was a that hitbox. Good RC, but you can get the conversion off. But the dolphin, Sea World, coming in. One hit, we'll take it. 2 H. Ooh. I'm sorry, everyone. Gotta be careful trying to challenge that uh heavy dolphin. And cheap taking game number two. Currently, the score is one one. If I had a dollar for every missed media, six H. Damn, May has Leo's two D. Are you really comparing May's May's terrible like slide to Leo's two D? Her slide is like the worst button in the game. It's so punishable and it gets like no no damage off of it. Not the slide. What do you mean not the slide? What are you comparing to Leo's 2D? Oh you mean her 5k? Yeah. That button is that button would be really good if May didn't already have amazing neutral buttons as well. Ooh, this dolphin! Catches her in the air. It's, old. it's the dolphin. It's the dolphin. Ooh. Hits him with the mix up of uh, not continuing the combo. American reset. Let's get out of there. That should be the round. Oh no! Sea World coming out. Jumps in. Ch uh -huh. Sheep trying to challenge after the S Dolphin block. Inadvisable. Dolphin. Dolphins. Dolphins trying to catch a back dash. No Dolphin, but this time he goes for the Sweet H Dolphin, but he tries to be aware of which Dolphins are doing. First slash. Hits him. First to get out. Ooh, catches him in the air with Mr. Dolphin. One more hit and we'll take it. Great Yamato attack, this is punishable. I think if you just did S reversal S Dolphin, it would have uh, it would have hit him. Anyway, Shibabra taking game number three, bringing the score to 2 1. You tried to 6P Dolphin. Big mistake, yeah. Don't try to 6P Dolphin. Whoever, like, whoever says just 6P Dolphin, that's a. Uh, that is not good advice. I feel like every other like good poke button is is better than 6P. I mean you can if you're base. But if you 6P Dolphin, you just get like a little bit of damage from 6P. As opposed to like other button poke buttons, which are often better. Because Dolphin loses to pretty much every other other normal in the game. Jumabra going in. RC off the bar slash. Hits him. Dolphin. Big damage! Oh my god. You don't want to get hit by that counter hit. You really don't want to get hit by that counter hit 2 edge. They will evaporate your health bar. Side. Good trip guard there. Anti air with the 5 edge. Ooh, good low profile speed. Spy sheep. Runs up. Nope. Uh, didn't get the good thing. Uh, combo conversion. Ooh, wake up gold burst. Ooh! Mr. Yamato, RC? Oh, no. I don't respect that play, because, uh, Ship could've gone for the RC cross-up. 
shenanigans and done like a bajillion damage. No respect there. Anyway, set point. One hit first to get out. One hit and she will take it. Does he jump? He gets hit. Ooh, but doesn't have charge in time. And she was taking it. 3 1 versus. Everyone together? She. May wins. Anyway. Fabra taking it 3 0 and continuing on with the winners back here. Uh, one second. I'm trying to determine if Jack Chan is ready for the next game. He told me in advance that he needed a little bit extra time. Yeah, it was 3-1. It looks like Jack Chan is not ready. So, we will be going on to Loser's Bracket. Um, Sheep, who just lost, versus Sarath. Wait, oh. Sheep Marathon. Yeah. Sirith is currently communicating with servers, so it should be like 30 to 50 more minutes. Wait, why didn't, uh... Let's get updated. It's weird. Yeah, I, I updated it on my browser, but I had to redo it, so... Alright! Looks like both people are ready. Going into game number one of Sheep vs. Sarah. Sheep getting a back-to-back. -back. Getting the salty run back. Zatau versus May. This all depends. This matchup all depends if uh, Zato can anti-air May or not. Zato gets a lot of damage off of anti-airing. The beach ball killing Eddie. Zato running up. Ooh, catches him with the frog. It's on. But he doesn't have any gauge, so unfortunately, no big damage combo up. Yeah. Okay, you have a have any gauge. Ooh, catches him in the air, but no damage uh, follow up. Nice. Stab, stab. Eddie coming around the back. Jump in. Get down. Okay, just, just keeps jumping in. And Sarah taking round one. Very good, strong, keeping the May out. Lots of pressure coming in, but he just jabs out of it. What a brave man. Just out the corner. H Dolphin. Very plus. Ooh. He Zato would have died if he got hit by that jump edge in air to air. Okay. Catches him. I'm pressing a button. Crusade. Coming in. Zato pressure, but he doesn't have any meter luck. It's caught in the air though. Wake up. <coughs> and the wake up throw taking it. And Sarah's up 1 0 versus Sheep. One second, I need a water break. My. I'm, I'm gonna die. Remember to stay hydrated. Uh, this stream is brought to you by water. Make sure to drink it. Man. At least five gallons a day. Oh, going 
into game number two. May jumping in, going just for the slide. Gets a lot knockdown, but doesn't get a lot of damage. Lots of pressure, but he just jabs it out. And then Shay. Eddie clap in the wrong direction. What are you doing, Eddie? No, frog? No, Eddie gauge. You be careful. Goes for the super. May was pressing buttons during it. Block it. Ooh, Orca, and he's dead. That's a lot of damage. What's Gallon in normal units? Has at least like 20 milliliters. Okay, jumping in, aside, but not a big punish. Get some, get some, uh, this is, though. The, uh, one of the best things that I'm seeing Sarah not do is, uh, oppose. Oppose versus the May jump-ins is so scary for May because she takes, like, 50% damage if she jumps into an oppose. Watch closely. Ooh. Very scary breath bump press there. Hit him in the air. Sarah is doing a very good job keeping the May out. A dolphin. Oh, but she supers when she's on plus. That is not a good idea. Sato had verse. And May living along the sliver. So Sheep is currently 1 1 versus. Sarah. Sarah the birthday boy. It's P.O. in English? How does that- what? There's a W there. There's a T. How is it P.O.? Into game number three. May do May things. Ooh, good back dash, but no good punish, unfortunately. Rocker Chad. They keep just jumping in. The key, the key to this matchup for Zato is to just make sure that uh, May doesn't get to jump in like this. If May gets to jump in like this for free, without taking like half her health and damage, she's just gonna keep doing it. Ooh, good frog anti-air. One of the best one of the best things in this matchup, I swear, is uh is drunk or, is uh opposed. Like look at this. Oh that is some damage there. You can get even more if uh if Mabel's was closer. Ooh, tries to air to air, but uh good uh good flying. By Sarah. Ooh, summons Eddie. Gets smacked. Super. Catches the air. Or catches the air button. Air dash. And Sarah takes game number three, bringing it 2 1 versus Sheep. Yeah, quarter circles are easier to wake up super with. Man, I feel like I'm the only one that knows how to do the uh, Guilty Gear super motion consistently. I hate double quarter circle forward. Sucks. Bro, you do no motions. Just spam up heavy. No, I have to hold down first. And then press up heavy. Eddie pressure gets jabs him out of it. Poor Eddie abuse. Can I get an F in chat for Eddie? Eddie pressure. Jumps in at him. Ooh, that's big damage, but no follow up conversion. Breaks up throw. But no big, uh. Ooh, wake up close slash. Oh, this should be damage. Super? Oh, he's dead? 
Yeah, he's... How did that miss? What? The Canadian burst followed by the uh, missed uh, super. What is this? I don't know how that worked, but uh, is there somehow managed to get, uh, find a way to make it work? I just caught him in the air. This is big damage. Oh no. Sarah's getting those really good anti airs. A lot of damage coming in. Oh no, the frog! He hit the frog! Okay, Eddie is here. Big damage. Can't press buttons after that super, otherwise, you, that happens. And Sarah takes it 3 1 versus Sheep. Sheep has been eliminated. It's the first. Uh, Combatant eliminated in the Jazz Guilty Gears Tribe Fighting Third Annual uh, Leo Downplay Edition Tournament. Sarah, the birthday boy, continuing on. Up next, let me switch to the bracket screen. Up next, we have Pio. Ver wait, uh, Pio versus Maddie. Hope I don't die again. I believe in you, Matty. Just sit back, relax, and think of trains. You'll be fine. You're gonna fight the weakest character now? Kai? Kai is not the weakest character, what? Kai is like... Mid-tier. At worst. Cause the weakest the weakest character is uh is Leo. Anyway, going in to game number one, Pio versus Maddie. Kai is mid? Kai is a menace because of Stun Deep Dipper unblockable. True, true. Fuck Stun Dipper. Man Five frame startup low? Yeah, that's that seems reasonable. <laughs> Okay, we have uh, Maddie on the Faust versus Pio on the Kai. Goes to favorite dress. Ooh, hits him with the Scarecrow. Hits the Faust thing. Faust thing coming in. I don't know what that was, but it didn't work. Ooh, hits him in the air. He gets the uh, gets the trumpet. Edge coming in. Yeah. Wish to throw, but no punish. Maddie's out of there. I get stun dipper. Gotta be careful with backdash and Kai. Pio loves the stun dipper. Counter hit, that's big damage. There. Oh, dive kicks. Good dive. Stun dipper, that's very punishable. It's like minus 15 or something. Uh, again, but that was also very punishable. Stun dip with the second hit was too close to connect, and the uh, RC makes it safe. Faustling's coming in, Faust Army coming in. Tries to stab him. Anyways, Pio taking game number one versus Maddie on the house. Stun Dippa. Can, Mad can Maddie make a comeback? Run it back. Why does Faust have IKEA worker colors anyway? He does throw meatballs. So, of course. Mankind. Duel 1. Let's rock. The Iclock. Stun it. Pass it. Good dive kick on the eye. Uh, I see you. The Iclock. Pass it. The fireballs. <laughs> 
the first whip. The slow catches him in the air with the uh, dive kick. Catches him in the air, air with the dive kick again. Baits the burst, but no punish. The uh, Faust army comes and saves the day. Oh man, now he's pressing all the buttons and Kai is counter hitting him. Didn't quite get the cancel on the mix, mix, mix. Got the punish. Ooh, doesn't get the punish, but he still does get the counter hit. He does get the counter hit, sorry. Catches him in the air with the 2 edge. Dual 2. Let's rock. Down throw once again, but no punish on it from Patty. Kick. 6P, get off of me. Goes low. Goes low. Jumps in. Kai. Keep jumping in. Whip punishes the uh, 2H with the uh, second edge. Hits the direct lob with the uh, the sweep. Out of there, Scarecrow. So far, goes for the uh, goes for some dive kicks, but Kai hits him out of the air once again. Going up 2-0 versus Maddie. The throw whiff into button frame trap is too strong. Yeah, it's so it's so um so good. You're expected to just like keep blocking, but it's a it's a flex when you when you whip a throw in front of someone. It's like you want to give them a hug, but they reject the hug, so they're like, "Okay, I'm sorry, I rejected your hug. So let here, let me give Mankind you some damage instead." That can... that, that's what happens. Duel one. Let's rock. I Game number three. Scalpel catches the uh, stun dipper with the uh, duck kick. Gets him out of there. Wow, he's getting out of the corner, just drifting away. There comes Rust. Mix, mix, mix. Ooh, hammer! Ooh, air rifle lightning to beat the dive kick and the wall break. I don't know if that's genius or uh or nutty. I'm gonna go ahead and say it's genius. Good edge once again catches the ice throw. Is that all you have to offer? Dual two. Let's rock. Set point for uh Tio or uh, for Tio. Got the meteors. Meteors catch him. The overhead stats. Stun Dipper. Stun Dipper. Stun Dipper. Stun Dipper. Stun Dipper. Stun Dipper. Stun Stun Dipper. 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 Stun Stun Dipper. Stun Catches the Stun Dipper. Maddie fighting for his life in this tournament. Dual three. Set point once again for Tia. Round start with the Stun Dipper. The classic. El Clasico. With the buttons. Catches him in the front track. Go first with. He's in the corner versus Kai. It's a, uh... Wait, that wall breaks? What? I've never seen that before. And Tio takes game number three. Takes it 3-0 versus Maddie. Challenge me again whenever you like. Maddie has been eliminated from the third annual Jabs Guilty Gear Strive bi-monthly, tri-weekly Guilty Gear Strive tournament. Up next... Up next, we have Wake Up Super himself, Bloopy, versus Milia, Be uh, Milia Believer, Piaja.
Who do you want to win here, chat? Do you want Bloopy to win, or do you want Piaget to win? Type 1 for Bloopy, 2 for Piaget. And we're going into game number 1 of Piaget versus Bloopy. Mankind knew that they cannot change Top society. tier character versus bottom so tier character. And by that I mean top tier Milia versus bottom tier Ramblethal. I root for Peter? How dare you. What makes you unique? Think you can catch me? Milia. Versus Ramlethal. Duel one. Let's rock. Goes for the uh, round start roll. Maybe goes for the throw. Misses the uh. This is Mimi. Millie is out of there. Just jumping out of the corner versus uh. Versus uh. Ramlethal. Yeah, with the sweep, goes for the cross under. Doesn't get the uh, combo conversion. H disc goes for the cross up once again. Still her turn. RC TK Batman goes for the cross up. Oh my God! How do you block this? Bloopy with these amazing blocks. Goes for H disc, but Bloopy jumps out of there, catches her. Good burst. Otherwise, Millie would have lost the round right there. Bloopy trying to jump out. Run up the lock. Respect that choice. Yo, Pusia is being so smart right now, blocking these supers. And, you know, Bloopy. Bloopy just does it sometimes. Gotta respect the choice. And Millie's out of there after the combo drop by Bloopy. And she's doing the air, but. She's doing some flashes. Duel 2. Let's rock. Elimination. Anyway, cutting back into the action. We're getting in the sweep, going for the cross up, going low with lunch again. Catches her in the air. Big damage. Goes low. Ooh, tried to bait the super. Smart choice. I still think that it would have caught the back dash though, unfortunately. TK bad mood. Ooh, run up block! Pija with the read, so smart. TK bad mood once again catches them and taking the round. Pija playing out of their mind. Luffy is swinging. Catches him in the air. Ooh, rolls under the sword. That's so smart. Someone watches LK. The going goes for the cross up. RC because he messed up the TK bad move. A Canadian burst. Oh, this is going to hurt. Doesn't get the combo off. Only goes for two hits of the Rekka. Billy jumping. Bloopy having a hard time getting it, anti airing and answering the jump. Jumps. Hits him with the carpool. Ooh, charge pull does the should be it. And he gets it. Piaja going up 1 0 versus Bloopy. Piaja playing so smart right now. I mean, playing smart on a top tier character, how do you even combat that? Someone, someone call Daisuke. Please call Daisuke and nerf this character. Will Bloopy fight back Man. and give Jack Chan more time Duel to get ready one. for his his follow up matches? First, get her off her. Yeah. 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 Ooh, goes for the frame trap. That wasn't a combo, but let's pretend it was. This is a tick throw. Just running at him. Ooh, that is hard to block. The cross up. Cross up low. Because I'm in the air. Ooh, does he have this? Oh, just a little bit of damage. But, his air dash cross up overhead. Perfect. Millie is showing who is the top tier character here. 
Those green hair car. I hate to see it. No punish on the on the non-canceled 2D. Getting the wall slap combo. Big damage. What happened to Millie's life bar? The roll went under that apparently. Let's get out of there. Jump ish. Big damage. Art, uh, YRC catches him in the air. But the reversal super kills him. I'm pretty sure that's a hundred percent punish on every follow up. Probably. Except maybe a lush shaker because I think that's a true frame. Uh, true block frame. Going to Amelia. Catches him in the air once again. Ram has a very hard time anti airing uh, Amelia. Ooh, catches her in the air. And now big damage. Wake up 5k. Tried to block tried to block the uh, wake up super. Very smart play by uh Loopy. Amelia goes for the cross up and goes up 2-0 versus Bloopy. Checking the opponent's connection. Oh, connection lost. Okay, cool. Hopefully, hopefully we can catch it in time. Yeah, he was definitely trying to reverse the super in the end. That that last cross up, I don't think it would have hit because it crossed up. You have to do the uh, autocorrect input. Can Bloopy do it? Bloopy, the people want Bloopy to come back to give Jack Chan more time. Can Bloopy make the the comeback? On this bottom tier character, Ramlethal. Man. Duel one. Let's rock. Front side roll. Goes same side this time, but cross up this time. RC, at this. Empty jump low. Cross up. Ooh, the cheapness. You're in the you're in the milia vortex. There's no block in that. There's no block in that. Dual two. Let's rock. Uh, according to Piaja, Milia is the easiest character to block in the game. Uh, I think after that round, we can all agree that that is definitely true. Or sorry, the easiest character to block in the game. Everything is completely reactable. Goes low, is in mix, goes for the double overhead. Obviously, hair car catches him in the air. He's gonna have a conversion. Fully charged, is he dead? He might be dead? No, not quiet. One more mix. RC, and that's it. Oh no, he needs one more hit. One more hit. And Jack Chan is at home on time. And Pija has taken it 3 1 versus Bloopy. Just in time, Jack. That was a that was a solid showing by Pija. Yeah, I, I agree. So while we wait for Jack Chan to get ready. 10 minute break. Oh, sorry, 5 minute break. Let me, let me actually like fix this. Okay, 5. Alright. Be right back in 5 minutes with an exciting continuation of the Jazz Gets a Gift Drive tournament arc.
Ladies and gentlemen, we are back with the third annual Jad's Guilty Gear Strive Fighting Game Tournament Extravaganza. We are going in to game number one of Jack Chain versus Moro, Faust versus Potemkin. Let's begin. Personally, I think this is a pretty uh, Faust favored matchup. Faust has a lot of tools to keep Potemkin out. Uh, Potemkin, once he gets in though, he just goes smacks Faust. Um, we're gonna get to the lyrics soon. Okay, we, we didn't get to the lyrics. We're all good. Mankind knew that they cannot change society. Duel one. All right, let's go. Let's rock. Slidehead versus that. First instantly, even though he was plus on block. Questionable choice. Ooh. The potem early Potemkin Buster. Wake up jab. Overhead. Doesn't get the 6B. Mix, mix, mix. Fireball. Backdash. Get plus there, please. Tried to anti air the mix, 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 but doesn't realize. Oh no. Jack Chan is just bullying poor Moro. He's trying to he's trying to 6P his uh his scalp. How did that overhead miss? The empty jump 6P. That was so smart. Like a fist, that's punishable. Jack Jab overhead. Bug gets jabbed out of the scarecrow, trying to get out of the corner. In the air, big back bomb, slide head, gets a hammer, back bomb once again, go for the overhead, hammer, catches him in the air, but no, he doesn't get a big punish, that's good for Jack Chan, jab jab overhead, he needs to be careful, Jack Chan has the combo, but no, more of burst, ow, oh. 6 is the uh, duck game coming in, the RC into the charge dust, I cannot believe Jack actually blocked that. So smart. Is anybody's mad? Anybody's set? Jack has burst. Bomb coming in. Doesn't get the punish on the uh, on the slide head or the hammer ball. And Flora. Mix, 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 but he's out of there. Back dashes. Good back dash on the hammer ball. Or on the slide head. Slide head. Jab, jab, overhead. Goes instantly. Oh, the command grab. Zemkin has an afro on. Tries to press a button, but gets hit by the uh, jump dust. RC. Meteor's coming in. Ooh, gets him hit with the slight or force slash RC. Goes for low again once again after the RC. RC, two jabs. Overhead, hammer, careful. Jack got hit by his own bomb to lose round number one. I was very confused at what happened there. Moro is currently up 1-0 versus Jack Chan. I don't know. I don't know how he got hit by that bomb. That was so sad. Faust's worst enemy is themselves. That and Daisuke. Can't forget the real Let's enemy of Duel One of the House. Dice game himself. Ooh, catches him with the scalpel. But he bursts it and gets hit anyway. 
No burst for a while, but misses the uh, tick, uh, tick pop buster. Jack RC goes low. Hand go coming in. Mix, mix, mix. But that's punishable, but he only gets a uh, back mega fist. Kowsling saving his life there. Ooh, good backdash on the pop buster. And then wake up jabs. Jack realizes that after the uh, after the slide head and full screen hammer pull, uh, Potemkin is pretty minus on block. On hit, sorry. The dive kick, but he blocks it. Jack going for the mix, mix, mix once again. Ooh, very scary there. Our character RC into the uh, command grab with the mix goes high, goes high once again. Gets caught, but no uh, no combo conversion off the of bounce. Could have probably did a uh, 5k and and got him. Do some bananas, and then he hits him. And then the pumpkin buster takes a round. Round three. Meteor's coming out. Scarecrow to the back, but gets hit by the banana! Or gets hit by the anvil. Sorry. Backdash is light head. Some, some bag bombs. Ooh. Moro just let him wake up there. I'm not sure what he was baiting. Big damage. Well break. Bounce links goes up for the command grab a little bit too fast. Meteors goes for the cross up, but not quite. And the dive hit takes the round, bringing the score 1 1. Jack Chan versus Moro. Very good play so far. And we are going in to game number three of Jack Chan vs. Moore, Potemkin vs. Faust. Jack Chan loves doing that overhead so much. Especially the jab jab overhead, that's a bad habit that I've, I've exploited against him in the past. Batting that hammer back to him first. Ooh. Missed time the uh, pop buster just a little bit. RC meaty. Uh, a bunch of hammers. Hit him with the hammer. Ooh, big stab. Is he gonna burst? He does burst, but gets hit anyway. I don't think that's a punish. You have to burst instantly to get the punish there. And I don't think Pot can get the punish there. Not like uh, Toad or Le Leo who can get the punish by bursting that. Mega Fist, but does he get the punish? They're jumping in, gets a hit. He goes for the butt stomp. Oh, you need to know that that's coming. Oh, he doesn't. He doesn't RC. He, he pot could have killed him there if he RC'd. But Jack went for the uh, the super the Faust super attack. Oh, he just he just doesn't. Even though he's minus. Respecting the Potemkin too much. Oh no! That was punishable, but Mora didn't get the punish. We were doing up we were doing up to him. Big damage. Sweet bomb coming out. That's for the anti-air. Pot gets hit by the bomb. Coming with the overhead once again. Jack trying to keep him out. Bomb coming in, but the overhead. Trump it. Tries for the dive kick. It's hit by the Faustling. Any hit will take it. Oh, so smart. 
He's gonna wake up Aegis Reflector. I told you! Grab it! He would have gotten it if he grabbed it. Stabbed him. Dive kick! Oh, but the 6 P takes it the scramble! Jack's so smart with the uh, block on the Aegis Reflector, but he didn't grab it! If he grabbed it, he probably would have died. After the Super Flash, when Potemkin does the Aegis Reflector, you can grab him, and it will delete the Aegis Reflector from it. So Jack lost a lot of meter, uh... He lost a lot of meter trying to block it, and I don't know if Pot is even unsafe if you do block it. Very close round. The score is currently 2-1, Moro Jack Chan. Let's rock. Got an aggro. Ooh, that's punishable. You can definitely get more than just jabs off of that. No burst from Potemkin. Probably not gonna have burst for like a, a couple of rounds because he uh, wasted it. Upgrade RC goes straight for the command grab. He probably tried to throw attack, but that wouldn't have beat it anyway. Punishable. Rejecting. Why you get the progress of time on the jab? Ooh, the bag bomb saving him from the big Potemkin damage. With the coming out, Jack always jumps after he gets the trumpet. Moore is being very smart with the 6Ps on that. And the tick throw, taking the round. Ooh, good 6P. But no followable hammer pull to get close to distance. The, uh, the overhead, the uh, hammer pull is just going straight through the overhead. Jack runs up and goes to the throw, goes to the mix, goes to the overhead once again, jab, jab, overhead. Ooh, that was so scary. He could have gotten scooped there. This is a set point for uh, Moro, by the way. Oh, the Frousting is a little bit too late. Hammerfall? RC? Oh, he burst to get out of the RC. RC? This should be the round, right? Yeah. Jack Chan trying to stay alive in this winner's bracket. Set point once again for Moro. Because of the time up high. Ooh, this is big damage. Can you get the just frame? Nope. Not quite. Ooh, a little bit too late on the air to air. Hello? Bananas, but runs up and gets a command grab. Okay, where's the mix gonna go? He's gonna go high, goes high, and that will take the game. Bringing it 2 2, Jack Champ versus Moro. Close, close set. Jack Champ fighting for his life to stay alive in this winner's bracket. Game number five. It is anybody's game at this point. Whoever whoever loses this has to go straight into their losers bracket match. No break. Duel one. Let's rock. Train for the mega fist. By the way, that is a minus two on hit. So it's your turn after you get hit by the uh, the mega fist. Goes for the overhead, but hammer falls straight through it. Ooh, good 6P. Ooh, 6P on the mix, mix. That's very scary. He's gonna go for the grab. No, he's not. He's just gonna go for the delayed 2H to catch a backdash. Big damage coming out. Oh, goes for the overhead. Jabs him out of the scarecrow RC. He's 
look at her at. Cross up Pop Buster? No. I expected it. No pun uh no punish on the uh on the hammer fall. Big damage on wall break. A lot of meter for Pot to play with after this. This is set point for Moro. Where's the mix going? Gum RC! But Jack dive kicks out of there. Goes low this time. Moro is expecting the overhead at any point in time. Gets him out of the hammer fist start up like jabs him out of the scarecrow. RC, but jabs him once again, goes for the overhead, stabs him, but he, despite having the afro, he gets hit by the sixth key. And Moro will continue on with the winner's bracket winner's bracket in three, two, very close set. Up next. Up next, continuing on, is Jack Chan versus Woman Sexer or Versus Woman Sexer. If you're if you're fast if you're fast enough, the uh, active frames of if you're fast enough with the 6P, it uh, beats it regardless. Because it, it has active frames while the uh, before the uh, scalpel becomes active. So like just the way that other buttons will beat. The scalpel. 6P will beat scalpel if you're fast enough, even though you have an afro. Uh, that wasn't rollback, that was just Jack messing up the uh, thing. Waiting for Woman Sexer to get on. I've not seen him. So, Woman Sexer has not responded, uh, so I am starting a five minute timer. So at 3 3.02, I will have to disqualify Woman Sexer. Because I've not seen a uh, seen a response yet. We don't get. It's possible he he won AFK for a bit, so that's why we're giving. That's why we're giving women sex for five minutes before we cancel him. Okay, this isn't Twitter. We don't just cancel people, errantly. So how's everybody doing? doing chat we having fun today there is a woman that requires sexing but jack jan plays faust faust isn't a woman this is a 10-0 matchup for jack jan Faust is non-binary? Yeah, but that doesn't mean he's a woman. It's a woman. They are a woman. Jesus. 
a universal 5-5. Yeah, either either Chip goes nuts or Chip doesn't go nuts. Either he gets hit or he doesn't get hit. It's a literal 50-50 chance. Millie has the same health? Yeah, but Millie is top tier on like Chip, who's a uh, bottom five, easy. Millie has better Oki and neutral? Actually fake. Chip's neutral is crazy, dude. What are you talking? Chip has like the best neutral in the game. His buttons are crazy good. And Chip's Oki is like super safe. Like he has so many good options that end in super safe options. I mean, I'm I'm a Millia up player, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna make up make up shit about Chip. Tell tell people he ain't crazy. All right, we we are gonna give Woman Sexer two more minutes to respond. Chip can Alpha Blade? That's unreactable? Yeah, but he has like, it loses to everything but blocking forward. <laughs> Any, every other option loses if uh, Chip Alpha Blades. For like, 20 damage. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, it looks like I'll have to call it for Woman Sexer. Uh, Woman Sexer has been given the allotted time period and has not responded, so I will be saying that will be a disqualification. Unfortunately, Jack Chan moves on, and Woman Sexer goes behind. Up next, we have. Piaja versus uh how do you spell this name? Piaja versus Tio. Jack Chan, get off the stage. You're not welcome here. Jack off the station. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, he's holding the tournament hostage. There's nothing I can do to prevent him from using this one particular station. Piss break, I thought I played next. Sorry about that, was petting my dog. That's not an excuse, okay? It's not an excuse.
13, 14, that doesn't matter. Oh no, Jack, you need to be careful of posting dog pictures. We're gonna- we're gonna dox you by, like, looking at the dog's eye's reflection. Piaget needs one to two minutes. So we are waiting one to two minutes. If Piaget is not here within one or two minutes, everybody can officially say that Millie is top tier. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back and we're going in to game number one, uh, Pio versus Paeja. I'm sure I'm gonna get these names messed up because neither are phonetically spelled correctly. Pio on the Kai and Paeja on the Milia Rage. Mankind knew oh, is this is this why is this why uh, Paeja complains about Milia so much? Because he's Milia raging. <laughs> You're, you're free to... You're free to... You won't even have the time to blink. <laughs> Come at me with your full strength. <laughs> anyway, I'm going into game number one. Do I do a million things? Running up, jumping in. Gets hit by the 2k. Ooh. Rolls straight underneath the fireball, but gets hit by the... Uh, the first hit the Stun Dipper. Blocks the second hit. Ooh, get down! Blocks the Stun Dipper. Dead Million Vortex time. Goes for the cross up low. Where you go and gets bursted out. Just random Sacred Edge catches the roll. Okay, Million mix up. Goes straight for the cross up. Ooh, big wall break combo. Calling on Fiesia. No RC on the Stun Dipper. It doesn't matter because Paeja didn't get the punish anyway. Cross up once again. Where is it going? That would hit on the front? How are you supposed to block that? Okay. Yeah, the, uh, PRC on the 2K. No one expects the the random PRC on the 2K. That's a direct lot. Get out of the air. Run up 2K. Cross up. Ooh, double cross up this time. H disc. Where's it going? Goes to the overhead. Ooh, catches him in the air. First to get out of there. Random stun dipper, but doesn't RC to get the. Uh, but doesn't have meter RC. That hit in the front. Goes on the straight in the front that time. Where's it going this time? RC into the wall break. Clean combo. No one expects the. Uh, the. Uh, he just draw H disc into uh, PRCing. Goes for the double overhead, but didn't cross up. Ooh, didn't get the punish on the uh, two, the raw two D with no cancel. Goes for the goes for the front this time. Not a combo, but just random my hair car RC. That's a throws. Goes for the throw again. He's gonna do it again. Throw again. Okay. Throw again? Yeah. I'm onto your tricks. He goes for the cross up, and he goes for the overhead, but he didn't even block that time. Pija, I'm onto you. I know. I know you're going for the throw. After you go for the uh, H disc throw, you go for the H disc throw every single time. I swear. I'm. The no mix-up mix-up. Yeah, it's genius. 
Kai honest mid tier with no chance against Milia? Okay, bro. Anybody who calls Kai an honest mid tier. Kai is not an honest character. Kai is not an honest character when he has a 5 frame stun dipper. Kai has no anti air? You kidding me? It's the best XP in the game. Alright, going into game number one, 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 uh, one zero, uh, Pio jump for Pio. Cross up. Hit him. Trying to stun dipper. Go for the triple kick. H disc. Oh, punish on the H disc. The cross up this time. Juggle. Uh, uh, uh. Oh! Went for the empty jump throw, but got thrown it instead. RC on the 2k. Ooh, just charged up the dust. Bold. Wait, that that hit on the back? How are you supposed to block that? What a what a bottom tier character Milia. What a bottom tier. What an honest mid-tier character Milia is. Front this time. Hit them with part, uh, close slash. Good win punish on the on the flip kick. Uh 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 uh. Next, oh, just DP. Get out of there. DP. RC. Get ways to the mix. Gonna go. And he just goes for the raw cross up, taking it in a convincing round. Two zero. Two zero. Piaja versus Pio. Can Pio make the comeback? Milia has the worst air movement in the game, Dicey please. True, true. Objectively worse air movement than Chip. So yeah, please, please buff Dicey. Mankind. Duel one. Let's Round start Stun Dipper being the back dash. Stun Dipper once again. Will Pyja just block the Stun Dipper, please? There was the mix going up. Goes to the front this time, a little bit too far away. Uh, Gold Burst gets him out of there. Ooh, rolls under the Sacred Edge. Oh, is this a confirm? No, a little bit too late. That would have been godlike, though. Dust combo, uh, uh, uh. Don't, keeping it simple with the dust combo. Ooh, the double roll! Excuse me? Just styling on him. What, what is this? What is this meme fest? Bianca, just block, please, for God's sake! For God's sake, just block! Dual <laughs> 2. The meaty stun zipper. Yeah, that's obviously gonna be a cross up. TK bad move. Ooh, good anti air, but didn't get the follow up. Was mixed. Ooh, goes for the cross up, but doesn't get the jump at H in time. With a meaty ride the lightning! So smart. No one expects the meaty ride the lightning read. What a godlike read. Go. Ooh, good burst bait. Uh, uh, uh. And Pio just takes it, convincing 3-0. And Pio has been eliminated from the Jazz 3rd Annual Fighting Game Tournament. The double roll. What a dumb... What a dummy with the double roll. And it works both times? It works both times? Are you kidding me? Alright. Jack Chan versus Zareth. I didn't buy this fight stick to not press buttons. Damn fucking straight, dude. You know, what you gotta do, what you gotta do, just gotta press some buttons like that. Uh, you know, I just, I just went a little crazy there, pressing some buttons. Plus is a state of mind. If you're not pressing when you're minus, you're a little bitch, okay? You don't want to be a little bitch. When I play Leo, anytime I'm minus, I just DP. Don't let them have fun. If they have fun, you're not having fun. It's a zero-sum game. 
There's only X amount of fun allowed in the video game. And the more fun you have, the less fun other people have. Imagine having a DP. Imagine playing a... I mean, I play bottom tier Leo, so I, you know, you don't get to complain when I play bottom tier like Leo. Anyway, we're going into game number one of Seraph versus Jack Jam. People almost freaking out that I didn't switch the, the screen. I see you. I see you. I have no idea who wins this matchup. Um, but I assume that, knew that they it's a Tau, society. it's a Tau thing. So instead of reflecting on themselves, they blamed the beasts. Heaven or hell. Who you want to win? Sarah the birthday boy? Or, or the people's champ, Jack Chan? Begin operation. Faust has no losing matchups? True. Leo versus, uh, Leo versus Faust is, uh, definitely Faust's favorite. Ask Jack. He'll tell you how much he, uh, beats me on my Leo. Before we're getting out. Ooh. It's a dive kick. Go you kick. In the air. Meteors. Go through the cross of how you blocking that. No one's blocking that. Goes for the air, but doesn't get punished. Jack going crazy with these, uh, with these scarecrows. Ooh, catches the backdash with a kick to the face, but doesn't get the combo conversion. Good dive kick. Jack taking game uh, round number one. Dual two. Let's rock. Dive kick. The toe. Doing the toe things. Pressure. He's out of there. Hits him out of the air with the dive kick, but he doesn't have Eddie. Eddie's here. Oh no! That's a lot of damage. The toe. What happened to your health, bar, Jack? Dive kick. Ooh, overhead, and he stabbed him. Is he gonna burst it? RC. Oh, you do a lot of damage? I do a lot of damage. I'm, I'm Faust. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, he got him! Why does that work? Okay, the, uh, the whip command grab into RC command grab. God like. Jab, jab, over. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. No fucking- that was robbery! Can, someone pl- someone please call 911. Fucking robbed. I was fucking- <sighs> Robbery. Jack Chan the Bandit. Call Daisuke. Slap some cuffs on this man. Punish for making the right read. Faust has too many iframes, nerf him. True, true. Can you believe Faust has a command grab that does like 50 hold damage? It's it's over it's OP. It's OP man. Mankind. That's like a that's like a close slash worth of damage one. from a command grab. Let's rock. Uh, Runs up. Jab jab. Goes to the tick throw. Okay, where's the mix coming? Goes high. Jab jab high. Eddie, Eddie dead to the burst. In the corner versus Faust. Ooh, stabbed him! RC. Okay, Faust, uh, Faust is in the, uh, the Eddie Vortex. Opposed, he backdashed. That was very uh, questionable. Oh, he's about to get dunked on. What? What? Can someone explain to me how Faust just hit him there? Because I don't know how he. I... Faust tried to dive kick. Dive kick? Can't be pressing buttons versus Eddie. Eddie is just a frog, man. Oh, Eddie's dead? Diving in. Tries to block, but you know. He didn't try to block, he tried to dive kick. 
Got a bomb. He's gonna kick it. RC to kick the bomb. What a godlike play. Ooh, good RC. Goes for the overhead. Where's he going? Ooh, he gets dunked. Scoops. Big damage. Hammer. Hammer. Comes with the hammer. And he doesn't take it the ground. Random scarecrow. Oh, and he tried to go for the throw, but you know, Sarah just wakes up throws anyway. Ooh, Eddie! The poor frog! Got hit. Ooh, wall break. Big damage. There's a mix positive bonus going up. He doesn't have Eddie Gage. A bit of a waste of Peter, honestly, on the wire seat there. Because he didn't have Eddie Gage, so what was he gonna do? Anyway, the round goes. To, uh, the game goes to Jack Chan. Jack Chan up 2 0 versus Aerith, the birthday boy. Everybody wish Sarah a happy birthday. Feels birthday, man. 3 2 reverse sweep. Let's go. Zatau. Gonna sweep it up. Download complete. There's no download. I'll, I'll tell you the uh, secret to uh, downloading Jack Chan, okay? Uh, he does random scarecrows, and then uh, he does jab jab overhead. There Man. you go. There's, there's all, the, all the notes you need. Oh no, Eddie! Eddie! Ooh, caught him in the air. Oh, this is gonna be a lot of damage. Oh, run up, meaty sweep. Oh, so scary. And he's out, he goes to the overhead, catches him. Doesn't block the, uh, the scarecrow. Jack tried to do the same, the same, uh, scalpel thing again, but that doesn't work on that super compared to Morbis. Okay, where's the mix gonna come from? Oh, he has, he has meter, so he's dead. Set point for Jack Chan. Can Sarah fight his way back? Got the sweep. Bananas? Goes on the other side, but gets blocked. Ooh, Eddie gets stabbed! Oh, he got him. Yeah. Oh. Hot potato. Tried to go for the scalpel, but got hit by the car slash. Goes low this time. He has burst. He's gonna burst. He's gonna wake up first. He's gonna wake up first. Oh no, he did wake up first. He wake up through. Ooh, went for the overhead. Any hit will take it. Scarecrow, trying to get the trumpet, but he's not letting him get the trumpet. Oh, he tried. He tried to overhead, but you know the frog came out. He hit him. His head point still for Jack Chan. Both people have burst. Jack burst out. Ooh, caught him. Pressing some fireballs. Gotta be careful with that. Come in the air, but no follow conversion. Got him out of the air with the, uh, the overhead. And Jack Chan takes it 3 0 versus Sarah after that robbery of that first game. Congratulations, Jack Chan. Unfortunately, Sarah, the birthday boy, has been eliminated from the tournament. Hello? Brackets, please update. There we go. There we go. Up next. Up next, we have Finn, the Triangle Enthusiast, versus Damsung. 
Jack off the station. It was my Faust. Amorphous is terrible and should never be used unless it's in a combo. True? Uh, Zato's supers are pretty bad because they're both, like, not invincible on, on startup. His, uh, his, like, sword super is pretty good for continuing pressure because it refreshes Eddie. Same with Amorphous, honestly. You can use uh, Amorphous to punish fireballs for full screen if you're fast enough. We are currently waiting for Finn, the Triangle Enthusiast, to show up. Shivabra shit-talking all these, uh, Faust mains. Meanwhile, he's playing the literal health spawn itself. Unbelievable. Alright! Both competitors are here, and we're going into game number one of Finn the Triangle Enthusiast on the I Know versus Foost Damesung Famsung The I Know The I Dash N O Mankind knew that they can I Dash No Duel One Let's rock <laughs> Lie down Got stabbed, got swept, mix, 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 and going, tries to uh, shimmy. Got some meteors, oh, the damage! Oh no, it's a disaster! Oh no! R and Jesus is on Samsung's side, and got the meteors for the big damage! Back. Oh, good back dash on the sweep, good whiff on it. Two. Let's rock. Ooh, get smacked. Going to no doubt. Jumping in. Stroking the tree. Goes high. Note again. Where's he going? Ooh, goes high twice. But great blocks coming from Damson. <laughs> Good air super. Stealing his turn back. That was super safe on block, regardless. It's like plus 30 on block, it's crazy. Run a command grab. Okay, where's the, where's the mix coming? He burst out, but he's gonna get hit by the afro anyway. Big damage coming out. It's gonna be a perfect? Is he gonna get peed on? Oh, the RC, but he grabs him out of the. Why uh, get it? Goes for the over uh, RC overhead. Where's the mix gonna go? Slap. Be my bottom bitch. And Damson going up one zero versus I know. How many people are upset? Please, please let me know if you're upset by me uh, intentionally mispronouncing I know. Look at all these top tiers. We have we have Fausts and we have uh, Enos. We're we're all the honest like low tier characters like Leo or Soul Bad Guy. Duel one. Let's rock. Then hit some low. Maybe low once again goes for the tick throw. Ty, ooh, good 6p getting him out, but he bursts him back into the corner. He's doing some, he's doing some S strokes. Ooh, good counter hit. Damage. Where's the mix gonna come? Goes oh, goes high and then goes low. High. Double overhead into R. Ooh, R sees before it that hits. I didn't know you could do that. If he, uh, if he RC'd after, uh, YRC after the super hit, it wouldn't have gone off because it's guard crash. So that was very good at YRC. Let's rock. 
Samsung pulling the lows. Fireballs. Ooh, goes for the command grab. Oh, uh, goes for the air throw, but he's still unblocked on. Those meteors have a lot of blocks done. He catches up. Trying to back dash, I think. Let's rock. <laughs> dashes up. Ooh, go, look, Proha is the chemical love. Ooh, missed in terms of meaty. Goes high, but he uh, first out to say safe. Good six feet. Good block, but he's gonna get RC it. RC it straight into the tick throw. She. You know, Vortex. Ooh, good frame trap. He's probably dead here. And Finn strikes back, bringing the series set 1 1. You know why, why they call her I Know? Because she knows how to beat Faust. Thank you, I'll, I'll be here all day. Alright, going into game number three. I just made that pun? What do you mean you just made that pun? Shut up. It's my one. pun. You can't steal my terrible Let's pun. Rock. It's such a bad pun. Why would you make it? Getting hit by the chemical love note coming out, but he bats it back. I didn't know you could do that with the note. Ooh, misses the, the uh, mini 2k. Fire scene. No meteors coming out. S-stroke, S-stroke more. Oh, jumps the A-stroke. Smart play. Ooh, caught him pressing buttons. Oh, that is a lot of damage that's coming out. It's copyright infringement of DNC in the stream? I'll see you in court, motherfucker. Run up, command grab. Was a mix up. Let's go some immediate straight into the instant overhead. Ooh! Stabbed him. Perfect. Perfect. Get peed on. Two one. Damn song. Showing, showing who who the King Faust is. The King Faust. Poor I know. I know nothing about this matchup. Haha! <laughs> Original joke, please laugh. Putting on a clinic. Duel one. Let's rock. <laughs> Don't run. Oh, so the the note back. Watch out for the mouse like. Just a prick. Ooh. Wake up throw to beat the uh the mini 2k. First before yeah, I got wall throw. That is very minus on blocks. Very lucky he didn't get hit by the meteors there. Ooh, 6p, the mix mix mix. Ooh, good YRC on the uh, on the super. I need I need to steal that. Ooh, 6p, get get off of me. Again, very solid round. Finn striking back. What's the count right now? It's 2-1 damn zone. 2-1 Faust. Stroking the big tree. This Faust likes to jump. If he just keeps stroking, like I don't, I'm not sure that he'll ever block it. Finn, Finn has figured out this matchup. He's just stroking right now. 
Every time he tries to dash, he gets hit by the 5H. Ooh, wake up super, but did he, what? Did he wake up first? What? Excuse me. Did you just meaty burst on, on his wake up? What the fuck was that? Excuse me. Excuse me. What? Did you meet him on his way? That's not how burst works. You fucking nut. Anyway, 2-2. Two, two. Eno. Eno. You know why they call her I know? Because I know you could do something stupid like meet him burst me. <laughs> Dual one. <laughs> Let's rock. <laughs> anyway. Good punish. H stroke, but he grabs him. Very good. Good awareness to grab the H stroke. Catch him with the air and the stroke. Uh, the stroke. We'll burst him out, but he's gonna get hit on the super. Anvil coming out. Oh, wake up! Command grab super! He knew. He knew he was going for the command grab because he had the, he had the anvil coming. That is so smart. That's actually- if you call that dumb, you're- you're actually wrong, because that was a genius move. That was genius. 200 IQ. <laughs> the, the very awkward, like, uncharged, uh, electric dash thing. Get him with the H-Stroke. Big damage coming out. There's a mix. Ooh, empty jump low. Gets the, uh... Oh no! He wasn't quite in range for that. That's a disaster. I tried to challenge him, scalpel, but he didn't quite get it. Oh, and he catches him. Set point for either person. Whoever wins this round wins and stays in winner's bracket. Sweet. Aphra coming out, but he just runs up the command and grabs anyway. Plays Aphra with another Aphra, wakes up pressing buttons. Canadian burst! He doesn't need to burst anyway. Uh, random reverse is super. Big damage. Where's it gonna go? Ooh, he tried. He next level played because he thought he was gonna go for the the empty jump super, so he backdashed, knowing that he would probably do something. Jump to the anti air. Anybody's game one hit will do it. And Damson takes it three two in an extremely close match. Damson moves on, and Finn goes to the losers bracket. Anyway, up next we have. The Faust Trader, Shivabra, versus M Moro the Potemkin. Oh no. Finn has to play another Faust af right after that. What a great set. That was a great set. I learned something today. I learned. Got Faust and Faust and Faust and Faust. All right. Both of them are here and we're going into game number one. Amora versus Shvabra. Potemkin versus May. I feel like this is a pretty good matchup for May. May has a lot of tools to keep Potemkin out. Just bar slash him. Just get him with the. Just get him with the. Smack him. With the bar slash. I'ma die. What are you talking? This is a good matchup. Just jump. Jump H. Just jump H. Dual one. We'll be fine. Let's Dolphin. Run. Dolphin. <laughs> Dolphin. <laughs> Ooh, big damage. That wasn't a combo. He was pressing buttons. Oh, I'm coming at the very end. 
Oh, oh no, the, it's lagging! Okay, where's the fix gonna come? You're close after that, please! Oh no, Aegis Reflector! Aegis Reflector! That's how an Arian says. Duel 2. Let's run! Six feet, get him out of there. Ooh, he's out of there. Out of the corner. Now Zepkin's in the corner. Oh no, tries to sweep, but no uh, no beating to RC it. Ooh, smacked. Got hit. RC. He has burst. He burst to get out. And he hit by Potemkin. We'll take the round. Ooh, very scary. Oh, 6P! Burst to get out! Just on the meaty. Watch out for the back mega fist! Oh, and he catches the back dash with Hammerfall. I'll watch for that. Mora up 1 0. It's very scary to do like uh, S Dolphins versus Potemkin. You don't need to do you don't need to do Dolphins versus Potemkin. <clears throat> you can IB Buster S Dolphin? Yeah, just IB bro. Just 6P the why would you IB the dolphin when you could just 6P the dolphin? Come on, bro. The key the key to this matchup, in my opinion, is to just bar slash bot. There's not much you can really do to it. <laughs> You don't really want to rely on Dolphin unless you're making permit, because you can pretty much beat anything that you can do. Burst, Burst to get out the big damage. Ooh, it's Dolphin! Take throw into Potemkin Buster. Probably could have killed him right there if he, if he RC'd the, uh... If he RC'd it. Ooh, big damage! Aegis Reflector! RC! Oh, you need to SD that. The key, the key when they do Aegis Reflector like that is to just uh, jump in and FD it. Mara really likes, against Mei, what I've noticed when I played him on my Mei is that he likes to do uh, back, uh, back Hammer Fist in the corner a lot. So it's never worth it to ever go for the throw. Just keep just smashing. Oh, he caught him! He caught him! Oh no! He's fucking dead! Oh my! Anyway, Moro up two two zero. He's fucking dead. So as I was saying, yeah, back Mega Fist, he likes to do back Mega Fist a lot. So the way that you beat back Mega Fist is you just press bar slash over and over until he dies. Because Pup really can't challenge uh, bar slash without getting like... You just do, uh, you just do far slash until like, uh, until he tries to whip a button to try to challenge it. And then you can golf him to whip on the buttons. Also, Pot doesn't really have fast buns outside of 6P, so you can pretty pretty easily do H Dolphin, like that. Ooh, tried to go for the throw, but... Oh, I respect the read and the jump. Ooh! Oh, I thought that was overhead kiss and it would've killed him! He's gonna burst? Oh no, that was a... That was an easy burst bait. Think my strategy Catches him in the air with the two edge. Hate to see it. Ooh, impact. Ooh, goes for the throw. This time just a little bit. Ooh. Runs up for the throw, but throws a, does a back throw instead of the uh, overhead kiss. Ooh, catches him in the 
air, that's a lot of damage. Canadian burst, I think he's dead. Chip could have, uh, could have honestly that. Run low. Goes for the back throw. He would have died if he overhead kissed. Dead? Oh no, 2H! Got a 2H that mid screen. Anyway, Shivabra taking, striking Everyone's back. 2 1, Potemkin versus May. Solid, solid play coming from Shivabra. Sh Shivabra. 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 There we go. That's how you say it. Duel one. Let's rock. Shivabra. Why is he pronouncing it? It's, it looks like Shiv Abra, okay? It's not my fault that I play Pokemon at an impressionable age. Anyway, going into the game, Vabra doing some doing some damage. Oh, playing this super well, just doing some car slashes, keeping him in the corner. Taking my advice. Smacking him. Ooh, the back Mega Fist into Buster. No RC though. So it got out for free. Survivor. So doing super well. Ooh, smack him. Smack him. Gotta be careful with those dolphins. Ooh. Counter hit, but no follow up. Goes low. Oh my god. The pressure. Quit pressing buttons, Moro! You're just getting mauled! Oh no, the butt slam into Pop Buster. You hate to see it. He does it all the time. Chip has a Dolphin RC, and he takes the round. Brings it 2-2. The adjustment. Oh my god, impressive play by Shivabra. Shivabra? Is it Shivabra? Yeah, sure it's Shivabra. Needs more Garuda? When was he gonna Garuda there? He can't Garuda. He just gets, he just get, just get smacked by a far slash, dude. I told you, there, there's one button that beats, uh, that wins this matchup, and it's far slash. There's not much Pot can do versus it. Ooh. Dolphins. Ooh, slide. Oh, that's punishable, but he didn't get the punish in time. Ooh, back Mega Fist. Crashes him. Jump in. Air throw? Oh, he tried for the air throw. I respect it. That was a scary air throw. I love doing that. Ooh, big damage. H Dolphin? Ooh, good 6 speed. First to stay safe, but he gets hit by the back Mega Fist just a little bit. A little bit too late on that first slash. He's in the corner. Set point for Moro. Ooh, slide. Footsies! Watch out! And Moro will take it. 3-2. With the counter adjustment, Garuda impact into Garuda impact into Garuda impact. Awaiting next report. Oh fuck! I never got pinged. What are you talking about? You never got pinged. I pinged you like six, seventeen people pinged you, bruh, bruh, bruh. Anyway, up next we have. Finn, the Triangle Enthusiast, versus the People's Champion, Jack Jam. My phone never got... Are you Team Jack or Team... I'll, I am I am the runner of the, to the host of the tournament. 
And I can't be biased, um, but I'm definitely Team Jack. Okay. I'll be perfectly clear right now. Team Finn? You guys are really rooting for the Eno main? Give me five minutes, gotta say bye to my grandma. We are giving Jack Chan five minutes to say goodbye to his grandma. The classic, the classic Jack Chan excuses. First, first he's petting his dog, now he's saying goodbye to his grandma. What a wholesome person. I can't believe Shiva failed me so hard. Hey Leo, you failed everybody so hard by not being in the tournament. You failed me, even though you're the most 1984 mod there is in Jads. Can we can we talk about about the time that Leo abused his moderating powers the other day? Abused. Abuse them. No, no we can't. Actually 1984. Sorry, I need to fix the South American economy. Nineteen sixty-nine. That's the year we went to the moon. Have you ever even read nineteen eighty-four? Of course not. No one's read that book. I assume. I assume in nineteen. We? Yeah, of course we, as in America. What do you mean we? Jack Chan is still saying goodbye to his grandma. Patriotic streamer. Anyway, going into game number- Wasn't America the country that ruined World War II? You mean won it single-handedly. Anyway, going into game number one of Jack Chan versus Finn. Eno versus Faust. The double unsync lobby music fucks with my brain. Duel one. Let's rock. Kicks her in the face. I feel like the that 5k is super strong for Skino. Oh, damage! Is Finn gonna get double eliminated by two Fausts? Ooh! Stabbed him. Six P. Oh the shimmy! Someone call Gutex, cause that shimmy. Oh my god. Someone, you could tell he was playing Street Fighter V the other day. With the shimmy. He's getting mauled right now. Break, big damage. Gap gap overhead. Ooh, RC. Damn it. Mix, mix, mix. Where's it going? Wake up, super. Hate to see it. Ooh, 6P. Got him. Got him with the grab. Broken him. Double overhead into the super. And this is the overhead right after. It's foolish of you to ever think that it's ever not Eno's turn. RC. Ooh, first bait. Big damage. Oh, but the, dro the drop combo by Jack. Ooh, 6P the scalpel. Very good 6P. Finn going up 1 0 versus Jack Chan.
It's like my worst matchup after Axel. The the secret to the Milia versus May matchup is to just always do instant air dash jump H. Jump back H. It's so good. Instant air dash back, jump H. There's nothing Milia can really do at first hit, unless they're on point with their jump ass. Here, rehearsal dope. Here, Mix mix. Oh, he's just running up! Insta burst. That only works versus me, Jack. Oh, he's he's just uh, always doing the 6P after the uh, after the uh, overhead. Go straight to the super. Big damage. Immediate H stroke. I wonder if you can throw that on wake up. Let me allow that. Overhead. Oh, he doesn't go for the ace stroke. Here's the ball stun. Ooh. Baseball bat. Catches him in the air with the dive kick. RC. What's he gonna do? Ooh. Needies. 2H. That dies. Trying to go for the 6B. Expect the choice. What's the scarecrow? Where's the mix? Oh, he went for the shimmy. I would have gotten hit. I would have. I would have looked like a fool there. He jabbed him out of the scarecrow. First on wake up. Everybody's game at this point. Ooh, that is punishable. Got a hammer. Dives over the hammer. YRC. Is it gonna go? Goes low. Catches him in the air. Well, Fousling fucks up the combo. Fousling, what are you doing? Oh, amazing blocks by Jack, but he got hit anyway. And 2 1, Finn Jack Chan. Wait, it's a it's two zero, right? Yeah, it's two zero. I said two one. It's two zero. Can Jack make the comeback? Man, duel one. Going into game number three. Ooh, six P. Get out of there. Meteors in the scarecrow overhead. He didn't believe in that. So he didn't scalpel. Come out of the air. Giant kick. Jump with the bomb. That kick to beat the stroke. Fridge with the stroke. In the Eno vortex. What's he gonna do? RC. Oh no, Jack! You sold the startup. That is unfortunate. That, is, that what happened to your HP there? You got hit by the meaty stroke. Set point for Finn. Tried to throw the H stroke, but he went for the S stroke instead. Ooh, good block on the on the dust. Ooh, got him! Uh, 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 uh. Got cut out! Oh, but he jumps! He didn't just wake up super, he jumps super. And Finn takes a 3 0 versus Jack Chan. Jack Chan has been a eliminator from the tournament. Eno wins. Anyway, up next. We have the Trader Gaming versus the Milia Down Player. After this, we will be taking a 10 minute break. I'm not downplaying Milia, I'm telling the truth. Yet you are in top eight. Curious. 
Hmm? Wait, this is top eight, right? Let me count. Yeah, you're in top six. It's even better. Top six character, Milia. Honest new, honest mid, honest mid. Honest mid tier Melia. Uh, we are waiting for uh, for a super sucker to get here, and super sucker is here. So we are gonna hop in to the game. Honest Oki Melia. Hey, Garuda is super honest. You just block it. What's so hard about blocking it? Mankind knew that they cannot change society. All right, we're going into game so number one. Shavabra versus Melia Rage. The beasts. I personally think that this is Heaven. slight. One. I kind of think Let's that this run. is slightly Melia favorite, but May does have the tools to fight back. It's all about how well Melia anti airs in this matchup. Ooh, gonna jump back. Every time, every time you see H disc in, at the end of their block string, if you just do up dolphin, it will crush her. H dolphin. Big damage. Oh, she's she's about to take it. Oh my god. She could have done more, too. That was a questionable super. But it worked out. Reporting. in. Honestly, every time every time Milia jumps, you can just board dolphin and just get out of there. Ooh, caught her! Didn't get the conversion though. Ooh. Good, good, uh, guess to run up and try for the, uh, run up 5k if I melee it, but it didn't work out. Personally. I would've gotten a hit, I was a May player. Went for the cross up. Ooh, Dolphin out of there. Ooh, 6p. Bay things. Goes for the sweep that super punishable. Piaget got the follow up, but messes up the OK a little bit. Ooh, no, no confirm on the counter hit. Tandem. Should be a dead Milia or May. And Piaget taking game number one. Milia versus May. There are four Fausts. No, there were only three Fausts. Shavabra is a is a trait is a is a character trader. We are going into game number two. Man, duel one. If Melia was a good character, Kaiya would have won. What are you look? What are you? What are you saying? I actually don't know the score anymore. I forgot who won that last round. Um. They're just jumping in at each other. This is what ground-based footsies looks like, by the way. The throw. Ooh, wake up, super. That's a wall break too. Oh no, it's not. Man, that super is terrible. <laughs> Ooh, hair car out of there, but she just gets smacked. But the jump H. Gotta be careful. May's best tool. Just gotta be watching the jump H. Ooh, that catches her. Them to jump low. H and him up. Cross up. Ooh, good burst bait. Which way? Cross up. 
probably dead? Oh, not quite. Ooh! The instant air dash should beat the, the throw. Auto in the air. Big damage. Tick throw. Where's the mix coming? Goes for the front this time. Jumping in. On his ground based footsies right now. Where's it going? Goes for the cross up. I would have gotten a hit. RC. R slash. Catches her. Where's the mix gonna go? Just goes for the flat once again. Amelia takes takes the game. Is it one one or or two one or two zero? I I can't tell. Can someone help me out? It is two zero. Piaja, showing what a top tier character can do. Bottom tier, yeah, bottom tier. May got nerfed. She's bottom tier now, for sure. For sure. Unlike top tier Milia, who got buffed. Ooh. Smack. The, uh, the run up 2k into instant overhead grass up. That, that's so cheap. Ooh, one of 6p, so smart. Okay. Oh. overhead, can get it. Frame traps. Oh, the double cross up in the corner. Oh, she really tried for the cross up once again. Cross up low. Honest, honest Oki. Look how easy it is to block, block everybody. Smacked her in the face. What's she going? Great. It's Dolphin, can't challenge that! He gets smacked! Okay, bad bird fighting back. Ooh, goes with the cross up straight into the raw dust. That was smart, but bad bird was waiting for it. Ooh, goes to the cross up into the cross up again. I, yeah, no, I don't even know what's going on at this point. I'm just sitting back and enjoying the show. Jump. H this. Ooh, caught her in the air, but didn't get the conversion. Auto with a low though. Set point for Piaja. Ooh, run up close slash. Ooh, six B. Ooh, got him! Super? Yeah! Okay, one more mix! One more mix and uh, Piaja takes a set! Where's it going? Ooh, run up 2k! Doesn't get the conversion! Why is he? up! Ooh, goes for the double overhead and takes it! Piaja! Taking it 3 0 versus Shibabra. You should pay more attention. Melia wins. Alrighty. We will be taking a short intermission, a 10 minute break, so that everybody can go get water, relax, grab a beverage, and get ready for the finals. Life. Game settings. Sound settings. All right. Anybody have any recommendations for songs? I think I know what song I, I want. Um. Maybe. Ten minutes. Ten minute break. Original bet? I was gonna do Disaster of Passion, but... I like that. I like that better. 
There we go. All right, be right back.
Hey, and welcome back to the Jads third annual bi-weekly bi-monthly tri-annual Guilty Gear Strive Strive Guilty Gear Tournament. Yeah. Anyway, let's look at the brackets right now. We are back. Up next, we have Finn, the Triangle Enthusiast, versus Piaget. I didn't say Piaget, I said Piaget. That's how you say it. We've been over this. Don't don't tell me I'm saying it wrong, otherwise I'll revert back to saying Pikachu, okay? Wait! Okay. Here, let's 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 listen. Pietcha. 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 Sounds like Pietcha to me. Pietcha. 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 Sorry, I'm an American. I can't. I can't pronounce these words. Anyway, the people are here. We are waiting for them to start, and we are going into game number one of Pikachu versus Finn. Milia Rage versus Eno. Uh, she doesn't have la. I guess her last name is is Man, no. I knew that they okay, first name is E. Society. Last name so O. Instead of reflecting on themselves, like old McDonald had a farm. Anyway, <clears throat> he Asia miss no, missing no. Letting the intros rock. I don't know about you, but the, the Guilty Gear Strive intros are just kind of underwhelming. The only good one is, uh, is Axel's. Melia versus Eno. Melia? Not Melia? Oh, the, <laughs> the double dash. <laughs> Is a TK bad move instantly. Throws on Wake Up. First, get out of the you know, mix. Si somehow, six keys the A stroke. I don't know how that worked. Oh my god. What happened? What happened to your HP? Just disappeared. Really doing a million things. Goes straight through a hair car. Straight up raw. Ooh, catches her in the air. Close slash. She just ran straight through the note and 6 beat it. What? Excuse me? Piaget just going crazy with just air dashes. It doesn't matter because Finn can just anti air any button. And Finn takes game number one. I don't even know what happened there. Did, did, did someone even, like, get a hit? Because I couldn't tell. These are gonna be- yeah, these are gonna be quick. Alright, we're going into game number two. It's currently 1-0. I know versus, um, me- Melia. What was it? Melia? Duel one. Let's rock. Melee? Melia? Hair car goes through the coast slash again, get the person back. What? Excuse me? Can someone How was that Nazir? She was behind him! What? What? I can't even pay attention right now. Oh, you're like plus like 20 on that. Goes high, high. Oh, sorry. Goes high, straight back to the wall. I I refuse to believe that uh, Eno's six H anti airs cross up. That's so dumb. Oh my god! What happened to your health, Amelia? 
Ooh, good into air. Back in the now you're in the corner. Okay. Yeah, apparently that does anti-air. That's not just a fluke. I've never seen that before. Uh, 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 uh. Wake up, super. RC it. Use all the meter. First to get out. Okay, you're in the melee mix up. Miss the double count. First to get out. Runs up to 6p. It's low. Oh, but doesn't get the compilable version. And I know. Goes up. 2 0. Like I know. 2 0. Get, get it? Anyway. I'm going a bit crazy now. We got the 2S and Mrs. Gatling. Alright. Game number three. Runs up and. Runs up to the dash, goes for the cross up. Cross up low. Are out of there. Using not to engage, gets anti air out of the air anyway. That's true. Ooh, 2 B. Counter hit. Getting out of there. Ooh, low profiles to jump in. Very smart. Uh huh, uh huh. Goes for the low. Ooh, I knew that was coming. Uh huh. Uh -huh. The ball break. One more hit, we'll take the round. Ooh, RC. Blocks it. Doesn't matter. I don't know if that was a punish or not. Ooh! Great block on the on the bad moon. But RC's it anyway to make it safe. Fusia, fighting back. Ooh, blocks the empty jump low. Very good blocks by Amelia. Ooh, grabs her. I think that I think that was trying to be a super. Oh, well, it gets hit by the wake up super anyway. Let's run. There, air card goes underneath the note. Where's the Oki gun gonna come from? Oh, she just jumps out! She's out of there. A stroke to get out. Cross up. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, one high, but we missed time just a little bit. You know? Ooh, runs up 6p, but a little bit too early on that. Catches her. One more mix up, and that'll be the set. Ooh! Tries to go for the throw, but misses the throw a little bit. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, burst at the last second. And he hit will take it. And Piazza takes the round, staying alive by just a, like, a little bit. Just a little bit. Score is currently 2-1, Finn Piazza. That was the most magical pixel, like, burst instantly once you got it. Cannot believe. That would have been robbery if Finn stayed alive there. Absolute robbery. That would have been confirmed if I wasn't doing bad air routes, by the way? Okay, bro. Hey, Bar hey Baird, why, why are you not uh, signed up for the tournament? That's what I thought. Ooh, double overhead because he tapped out of the pressure. Ooh, too deep. Where you going? Ooh, just charges up the, the dust. It doesn't get the conversion off. Or gets blocked, I mean. No, no. Gets hit. Set point once again for Eno. Smack her in her face. Ooh, the meaties. A lot of damage. One more hit by the Eno, but we'll take it. Ooh, first to get out. Now it's actually one hit. Ooh, tried to bait the burst. Tried to bait the super, but doesn't offer it. And Eno will be taking the set. Finn moves on to lose his bracket finals. 
Piaja has well, been eliminated. You made it to the bridge. Anyway, we are going into Dam Damsung versus Moro. One round you won was pogging so hard. We are currently waiting for Deng Demsung to uh, get here. All right, it's like we are here, about to begin. Is the uh, station bugged? Nope. Okay. We are going in. Game number one of Moro versus Dam uh, Damsung. Are we gonna get the uh, lyrics? Okay, we're going in. Almost got the lyrics a little bit. Man, duel one. Good, good song choice for the spark. Oh no. A little laggy. Hammer coming in. Blocks it. Ooh, you could have pop bustered that if you wanted. Pop buster. No. He's not man enough to reverse a pop buster, the mix mix mix. Damage! Slide head. Goes there once again. Mix mix mix. Because he has a meter to RC it. He just goes mix, mix, mix once again. Ooh, clash! Munch, munch, munch! That should take the round. Damn, like going in versus the other uh, Pumpkin, using all his meter on the mix, mix, mix RCs. 6p to get him. Oh, what an impact! You can't be pressing buttons versus that! What happened to your health? 6p. With impact? RC'd it, but still didn't get the uh, anti air. This is too gross. Alright, Zapper goes high. Ooh, does it ignite it? So smart. Goes for the anti overhead there. RC, overhead. He went for the uh he went for the jump trying to uh bait the pop buster. Oh no! Faust you're gonna get hit by the afro! Okay, he doesn't get hit uh, the afro. Well, mix mix mix, but gets grabbed! Laura takes the round. Duel three. Let's Stab him with the scalpel. Is it? Come on, Jump the trumpet. We're running up to get the trumpet, but gets the after it too. Ooh! Gets the uh gets the trumpet conversion, but just get the full combo off of it. Maybe close by. Mix mix. RC. Ooh, baits the burst! Very smart. Gets the wall break too. Has a lot of health remaining and burst. So it's a very good position for the mouse player. Ooh, gets hit by the meaty close slash. It's over. Hits him low. One more hit. Close slash will take this. And Damson goes up 1 0 versus Mora. So who is everybody rooting for? 
right now. We're in front of the Faust or the pa the Pout? The Paust. Moro gang? You're really rooting for the Potemkin? You guys make me sick. Make me sick. I mean, Faust is top tier, so like, why would you want to root for a top tier? It's like rooting for Milia. Ew, gross. Never get hyped for grapplers. One. <laughs> True. Let's rock. Grapplers are fake hype. Don't believe it. You can get a much better punish on that mix next mix block than uh, it's a jab. Ruda. Smack him. Ooh, big damage coming in. RC? Finish him all. Oh, but he doesn't get the combo. Ooh. Get him out of the air! Oh! That bag saved his life. He was about to take all the damage there. Any hit will take it, but uh, the Potemkin. Ooh, 6P and Scalpel. Takes the round. Good reaction, Spizer. By Moro. Let's go. He's just throwing all the items. Airball gets him out. He's out of the air. Take this forward. Skaruda. Ooh, he went for the high that time. Ooh, Mega Fist back! Catches him! Big damage! Ooh, maybe 2 H. Get out of there. Ooh, 6 feet! That was a great 6 feet. But what punish? But mix, mix, mix. Throws him out of there. He's going in. Yeah, mix, mix, mix. RC. Big damage coming in. First to get him out of there. Ooh, 6P. Let's mix. We're gonna impact again. Oh, he's trying to chip him out. Oh, and he 6P's the, the mix, mix, mix to bring the score 1 1. Good reactions to 6P that. Unblockable chip. Yeah, Gar Garuda, Garuda's a good button. Garuda's a good button. I think most people will agree. Garuda's a pretty good button. Just, just don't let him, uh, just don't let him knock you down. It's easy as that. Simple. Duel one. Let's rock. The game number one goes up, runs up, gets the command ground. Where is he coming? Ooh, goes for the double overhead. And the afro breaks the wall for him. Ooh, tried to flick the hammer, but he just escaped from behind him. He gets hit by the hammer. Man, that was a sick round. Let's run. Uh, Ooh, runs up and eats him. Goes high. Goes low. He's gonna get the trumpet. He has the trumpet. Gets safe pressure because of the trumpet. Ooh! And the afro. Is he gonna go high and then just go into jump high again? Yeah. Wake up super. He could have blocked that. He didn't need to burst it. <laughs> but just pretend like he, he didn't need to it. Aegis Reflector. Ooh, got him. Run him all the way to the corner. Ooh, hit him out of the air! No, but he gets hit by the jump dust. And damn song. Bringing it 2-1. The super's not burstable, it's just the, um, he wasn't in block stun, so he could've just blocked it. 
It has like it's like a ten frame. It's like a ridiculously long start up, Val Super. So like you can do things like meaty jab and beat Val Super. Duel one. Let's rock. <laughs> Good 6B on the mix mix mix. Smack it. RC goes low and then goes high. Ooh, mistimes the command grab and gets punished for it. Moral fighting back. Duel two. Let's rock. In the corner against cross pressure. Gets hit by the close slash. That should be a wall break with the super. Did he just like unhook him from the wall with the uh, high bet H and then throw him back into the wall? That was a clear. Beating jab. RC. Overhead once again gets smacked. First, but it uh, doesn't connect. RC. Here's the round. Make this board. Protect by the trumpet. A good choice. Got no sing coming out. Block string. Scarecrow coming from the top rope. Hits him. Uh uh. Anvil coming in. Pressure goes low. He slips on the banana before his meteors come out. That's so sad. Person, get out the pressure. Any hit will take it for the smash player. And this is set point too. Ooh, RC. I think he's dead. Oh, it's very close. Heavenly Contempt can bust him. He gets the Pop Buster. Can he make the combo? Come back. He's in the corner. Slide head. Mega Fist forward. Oh, he got him. He got him. He's dead. He's dead. I thought he was over. Oh, my God. I'm disgusted. I'm disgusted. 2 2. 2 2. 2 2. <laughs> Damn, Suck actually held a gunpoint and mugged. True. True. That's, that's some fucking. That's some fucking robbery right there. <laughs> Sometimes you just get grabbed. Sometimes you just get grabbed. And you lose half your health because, uh. Because you tried to jump. Don't jump. It's your fault for jumping. Duel one. Let's rock. <laughs> More must be feeling himself right now. It's over. It's over. The mental damage of that having the Kazakian Buster. It's 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 over. He's gonna get comboed by the minions. Oh, he always goes to the insane overhead and never goes to the low. Ooh, good throw. The Bruda impacts. Oh, he didn't jump. He's so scared. I he he was so scared of that. Oh, he messed up. Oh, and he grabbed him out on the phone! Oh my god. Moro Moro is feeling himself right now. He is so scared of the Heavenly Potemkin Buster. That that psychological damage. I don't think he will ever recover from that. He will never recover from that Heavenly Potemkin Buster of that last game. Okay. 
RC, but he jumps it. Doesn't get the. He doesn't get the. Ooh, side fist to beat the scarecrow. Oh, he's so scared. Why are you scared, Moro? Be a man. Ooh, meteor's coming. I'm gonna block the meteors. And he runs up and gets the meteor two K. Uh, two K. Set point for either person. Whoever wins this round, stays in winner's bracket, goes to the grand finals. Ooh, six feet. Get out of there. Ooh, first to get out of the group of meeting Garuda. Sits on the banana peel. Watch out! Oh, Joe goes, they both go for the air of the grab, but they both miss. He did it! He finally punished that with the the pop buster. I'm so glad. Oh. I respect the read. I respect the read. I was smart. You got the trumpet. And it's coming. Oh no! He could have gotten him maybe pop buster. And he hit. And he hit. We'll take it. Oh! And he gets him with the hammer fall through the hammer. A literal hammer, hammer fall. Proceeding with the mission to and Moro takes it. Copy that. Three, two. Next report. Oh my. Highway robbery. Someone call the cops, man. Someone call the cops. Cause that was, that was some robbery right there. That was, that was, that was actual robbery. Okay. Gamsung versus Finn the Triangle Enthusiast. In losers finals, this is the um. Just to be clear, this is uh, different tournament rules than the previous tournaments. We're only doing first to three. We're not doing first to five for lower end winners winners finals. So it's just first to three because nobody wants to see a first to five. No, it's just too long. Anyway. Here we go. The rematch. I know versus. Uh, how do you Duel mispronounce one. Faust? Let's rush. Give him a donut. Ooh, stab! Stab him out of the air. Pressure. Ooh, go from the top, but gets hit. Canadian burst. Gives him the free first. Ooh! Actually caught him with the wake up super. This might wall break? He might be close enough to wall break. Oh no, he's not. Not even close. Ooh, the shimmy! Great shimmy. And goes low to finish off the finish off the round. I know versus Ballhead. Stabbed him. Went low. Bananas. Anvil. Ooh, caught him in the air, but doesn't get the conversion. So once again, from the top. Six P to get through the pressure. Big damage. Don't mix up. Oh, you can just low profile the node sometimes. That's pretty nice. Low. Tried to give him a trumpet, but super gear like plus a million there, blocking it in the air. I think, I, I don't know if that was punishable to air block it. Anyway, I know takes a round. I know who won that round. It was Eno. Stab him. Stab him once again. Ooh. Keep stabbing him. He's not gonna 6p it, just gonna stab him. Next mix, RC. Does he have the combos? Not much close to the corner, so he doesn't get big combos. Oh, there are like three bombs back there! Watch out! Got him once again. Went low. And the, and the minions come and get the conversion off. Faust going up 1 0 versus Finn.
Staying at long range versus Faust equals death at Sims. Yeah, Faust is a long range zoner. So typically you want to get in and stay in. But Faust is a be slippery sometimes. Oh, the gold burst. Oh, there are so many bombs! Wait, gonna get the trumpet. Oh no, you know, got the trumpet. Ooh, 6P, get him out of the air. Oh my god, that was so cheap. The delayed RC into the grab? Ooh, caught the back dash with the 6H. Caught him Tekken. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, you, you need to jump over that. That, that's just match of knowledge right there. You can't just like uh dive kick back on a jet. Protect. With overhead, but it's grabbed. Turn the corner. Now you're in the Faust mix up. He's gonna punch you. Ooh, ooh, reverse and super gets him out of the corner. Very small day. Uh the hero burst. He has a long way to go. Ooh, stabs him out of the air and gets the trumpet. Where's he going? He goes from the, up the top. Oh, and then the minions come and help punish it. And then he goes for the scarecrow RC back into the corner. He has he has meter RC. Goes for the overhead into actually he just goes straight for the close slash and gets it. That was robbery right there. Stabs him. Overhead. Keep stabbing. Punched him. Bomb combos. Wombo combo. Goes low. Okay, it's a hammer. You know, gets hit by the hammer. RC! Oh, he tried to go for the command grab, but gets jabbed out of it. Ooh, and then gets the overhead. Can't low profile that overhead. Because he just slams you to the ground. 2 0. Damn, son. Finn. I can react to I, I, Eno's mix-ups. Eno's mix-ups are horseshit. <laughs> There's no way you can react to half of that. It's actually crazy. Because she can always go for the double overhead, which is... I'm fairly certain the double overhead's unreactable. Duel 1. Let's rock. Anyway, going into game number three. Nope, coming out. Back coming out. Ooh, bat in the note back. Goes to the overhead. Overhead into mix, mix, mix. Goes low. Oh, the hammer, but he was a little too far. That was so smart. Ooh, minions coming out. Running up, going low. Ooh. Good reversal super. Punish the mix, mix, mix. A lot of damage. One more mix. No, got it. He got it. He drops it, but he still goes low and gets the hit anyway. It's two hammers. He's just throwing items. Can't approach when he has so many hammers out. Watch out for the bomb! I told you to watch out for the bomb! Oh, this is a lot of damage. Uh, uh, uh. Ooh, stabbed the chemical love. Got meteors. RC back, or scarecrow behind him. For the mix up, the Jack Chant special. Oh, he just keeps shanking him. Pretty sure his, his stroke probably goes under that. I think Finn isn't going nutty enough. Ooh, RC gets whacked out of it. Ooh, big combo. He's not dead. But he needs one more hit. 
More hit. Is this gonna be a robbery once again? Wake up super, but gets gets hit. Not a big punish though, unfortunately. Any hit will do it for either person. Ooh. Very minus. Wake up super takes it. Two one. Damn some pin. A scramble. I want to see. I want to see the Eno versus uh, Potemkin. That's what I want to see. Get out, get all these filthy like top tier Faust mains out of here. Finn doesn't respect Faust enough. I I think Finn is respecting Faust too much. Like you you kind of just just go dumb and do like random heavy strokes and Duel neutral one. when he's doing the the, uh, the pokey stabs. <laughs> Like right here, if he was doing heavy, heavy slashes, yeah, like that, boom, smacked him. Like he's just a true run up. Give him the afro. Why are see? Or what? Get the booker to get him out there. This is a lot of damage. Uh, 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 uh. Set point once again for Damn Song. Duel two. Let's rock. Chuck and items. Faustly like coming out. Hit some low once again. Faustly like coming out. Oh, and then he goes for Wake Up Super, which is really smart. Because of course he's gonna go for Wake Up. Uh, he's gonna go for Command Grab there. Faustly so close. Ooh, gets him out of the air. One more hit, and Damson will take it. 3 1 versus Finn. Going back. Getting the rematch versus Moro. Can Damsung go the distance? Grand Finals time. End the Faust. Can you believe that people are actually rooting for the uh, against the Faust? Go in the distance. Cue the Rocky music. I would, but you know, I would get DMCA'd. Right. Knew that they Here we go. Game number one of the grand finals. Moro versus Damsung. Potemkin versus Faust. Battle of the top tiers. Not a Leo in sight. Which is uh, was an odd because Leo is a trash character. To respect, I will defeat you. Potemkin versus Faust. Duel Let the intro rock. Respect it. Let's rock. Mega and out it's uh Mega Fist. Ooh, good Mega Fist with the uh counter. Ooh, six feet. Get him out of there. First to get out of the Garuda meeting Garudas. Good choice, honestly. Ooh, good tech. Okay, but no punish. Ooh, not quite. I respect the choice, though. I got the different command grab. The next thing to go. Oh, tried to go for the air grab. Hard read on the Potemkin. Ooh. It will take it for the top player. Bomb him out. Ooh, gets combo from his own anvils. Oh, and he goes through. Big damage. Okay, where's the mech's gonna come from? 
Oh, he just, he just let him chill. He gets hit by the jump in when he tried to go for the slide head. Slow. Meteors. I would have, I would have gotten hit by that because I thought for sure we'd go for the command grab. Ooh, the wall break. That damage. People say bounce damage is low. Gets him in the air. Combos him. Burst. He's on a sliver. Can he rob? Is this robbery gonna happen? But no, he goes for the air throw. Danzong going up 1 0 versus Moro. Did Kao say Ali Oop? Yeah, he says Ali Oop when he air throws people. Connection lost. Oh no. It's fine, surely, surely Daisuke won't screw us over for the Grand Finals. Is Dr. Baldhead not Faust? He's not a doctor. Where's his medical license? He has medical license on his map? That's... That's not a medical license, that's his ID tag. That's completely different. You don't carry your medical license on your neck. Dual one. What do you mean he's Let's carrying it on his neck? Those, those are stethoscopes. What are you talking about? He's a legit- No, he's a serial killer. I'm pretty sure once you become a serial killer, you lose your medical license. Anyway, there's a game going on. Potemkin Buster. Hits him with the meaties. Donuts. Ooh. Smack him! Damage! Damage! Alright, where's the next gonna go? Make a fist forward! Are you? Oh, he didn't get hit by the uh, the Potemkin special of the Butt Slam and the Pop Buster. Ooh. Punched him! Gotta be watching that! Let's rock. This is no time. Impact. He's going. Ooh, just goes for the pop buster. His life is gone. Oh, it goes for the pop buster again. He's not gonna do it again. Oh, he. He's so smart. He's. He's so smart right there. There's no justice. There's no justice. 1-1. One, 1-1. One. One, one. Why do you lose 50% for blocking? Because he, he's Potemkin. Oh my god. My nose is itching. What's... You know, Potemkin, Potemkin just does Potemkin things. If I play Moro right now, he would just be st stuck in the corner and block stun for the entire game. He'd literally, literally be holding down back the whole time. Anybody who roots for a grappler unironically is actually like a small brain of you. They're like, oh, big number! Unga Unga! See, no one gets hyped when they miss the Pop Buster. Oh, look, he just missed the Pop Buster! Oh, sick throw by Damson! See, no one gets hyped for that. Ooh, 6 P. Scalpel. RC? Jumps out of there. Ooh, watch him with the hammer. Anvil! Ooh. Runs up! Oh, goes straight for the ice. Charge dust! Mora's waiting for it. Gets the slipper left, Mora gets the slipper left, and gets, just gets smacked in the feet. Dual 2. Let's rock. This is 
Minions coming out. Bust slam. Oh, he tried to he tried to go for the pop buster. That was just a miss input. We all know that was a miss input, and it would have worked too. I'm I'm disgusted. Get a smack. Doesn't block the afro. Ooh. A little too early on that. Two air throw? Back mega fist. Getting the sword. Getting stabbed. Gets hit by the overhead. Damn some going up 2 1. Game number four. Duel one. Let's rock. Smack him. Oh, Is the next gonna come? Oh, wait, jabs. Oh, that is not a punishment for Dumpkin. Now he's not gonna have burst for like the next five years. <laughs> the, the uh the overhead into fly uh Joker. Respectable play. Oh no. I I don't know what's going on. Through the impact. That goes through. Man, this man tried to life jam? Yeah, he, he kinda did, didn't he? Potemkin, ooh, Potemkin Buster, he messes up the input! Ooh, hammer put through it! RC. Get a hit. Oh no, don't hit. And get some love. And I believe that is a bracket reset, correct? That's 3-1? Someone confirm. Yes. Okay. It is bracket reset. Now it's just one more versus the three. And whoever wins this wins the official Jad's Guilty Gear Strive third annual monthly annual semi weekly Guilty Gear Strive Jad's tournament. Good impact. Mega fist. Didn't get the punish on the uh, mix, mix, mix. Ooh, good throw. Ooh, blocked it. Oh, this is. He's dead. He's actually dead. You could have RC'd and killed him! Mora, what are you doing? I hope you I hope you lose this round and get punished. There's no justice. No justice. No justice. The meteors. That was not a good trade. Make a piss forward. Oh, 
Ooh, good flick on that hammer. Shock barrier. Ooh, juggle. Aegis deflector. Things coming in. Ooh, empty jump pop buster. I saw that coming from a mile away. Now you're about to take the Mady Garudos for the rest of your life. Oh, that was that was it. That was Heavenly Potemkin Buster. I saw it. I saw it. You saw it. Everybody saw it. No justice. Marcy. Instant overhead into man grab. So Marcy, get out of there. Probably not the best you see here. 6p? I don't know. What did That was interesting. It's a mix, 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 but it could punish. Yes, first, he's gonna wake up first. He woke up first. Any hit will take it for either person. Ah! Slide head. Mega sweep. Mega fist. Oh, that was Tempkin. That was having the Tempkin Buster. I, I respect that choice, and then the 6p takes it takes it out. I don't I don't know what the score is anymore. I'm not even following. So if if people in chat can just be be my guide and tell me what the score is after every game, I'll be I'll be thankful. Cause I'm too hyped right now. It's one zero pot. One zero pot. Can Damson go the distance? Is the thing. Anyway, there's a game going on. Mix, mix, mix. Both have zone at first. Bomb coming in. Goes for the command. It goes through the regular throw. Bomb blows up, but doesn't hit anything. Goes for the overhead. Tries the six p the the overhead there. Ooh, but he doesn't get the wall break. Be careful! He's gonna pop buster you. That was a pop buster. That six p. That was definitely a pop buster. Oh, he went for the pop buster there. Marcy, but didn't get punished for it. After the beat block meteors, he just launch goes up for the throw. Is it going Mega Fist? Ooh, tried to go for the 6 but missed it a little bit. Big damage. A long way to go for Pug and Potemkin. Any hit will take the Faust. Ooh, 6 speed. This is the comeback. We're to impact. Where's it going? Sweet. Ooh, hammer fall. Where's it going? Goes for the charged uh, dust. It doesn't get it. Ooh, good air attack. Ooh, flicks the bag back. Ooh! Watch out for the bomb! That brings it to 1-1. One, one. The Temkin Faust. Going into game. Number three. Duel one. Let's rock. Slide there. Hammerfall. 
little bit too high for that in Hammer Pulse work. That's a good trade in Cop's favor. Ooh, went to the, went to the Pop Buster, but didn't get it. Ooh, Mega Fist. Oh, and he goes straight! The minus two Mega Fist on block. Go straight for the Pop Buster! He goes for the Pop Buster again! Oh no! Oh no! Mega Fist. Pop coming out! Nom nom nom! Get ready to go now. Go high. Ooh, goes for the take throw one more time. Here we go. This time goes uh, high once again. He hits him with the 6P. Another so wall break, but he he uh, bursts to get out. 6P. Garuda. RC goes for the pop up. That was that was 100% like predictable. Ooh, good 6P. Good impact. Where's he gonna go? Ooh, goes for the flick. Oh! Oh, that was, uh, that was Heavenly Potemkin Buster. You could have seen. You saw that buffer in. Oh, and then the blood! Fuck! Oh, Mega Fist into the Pop Buster once again, hitting him with the cheap shit. Oh, no. 2-1 two, two, Faust. Or 2-1 Pout. Poust. Yeah, never, never FD Potemkin. If you FD Potemkin, you're about to get Pop Buster, dude. Duel one. Let's rock. Come on, Ooh, make it. Slide Tempkin is once again in the corner. Ooh! Burst to get out. That was so scary for the Pounce player. Punching him, but uh. Monse block strings. Have a look at Tempkin Buster! Oh! He wanted to do it. <laughs> it just keeps doing the 2k. Oh, hit him. I don't think that would've- if he, uh, timed that correctly, he would've gotten it grabbed through the Aegis Reflector. Oh, it went for the pop That was actually smart. Oh! He got him! Oh no! Telling him not to do that! Don't fucking die, you can't get mix, mix, mix me! You ain't about to get fucking pop -bustered. Tournament point! One more round! And it's over! She got stabbed though. Go slow. Go slow. Take crap. Oh, RC. Punched him. Scary slide head. RC to miss Cop Buster. Oh, careful! Oh, first to get out of the Pop Buster. I was gonna be dead right there. Needed 2k. Get some out. Now things are coming in. What's the bag back? Ooh, punches him! Samsung fighting for his life to stay into this tournament. Mega Fist. Oh! Oh, you're gonna command grab me? I'm gonna command grab you! He goes for it again. And another one. RC. Jumps. Ooh, tried to hammer fall through the bag. Ooh, tried to get the back backdash once more. Charges with the dust. Good air. Uh, good hot. Ooh, 
Ooh. Almost. Coming in. You should always expect the, the Faust to jump point when you get the trump hit. Oh. oh, he almost got him. Fire C. Ooh, caught the back dash. He's so scared of the pop buster. Oh, 6P on it. Over to impact. Ooh, Mega Fist in the air. That's plus on block. Got him. Oh, he got him with the minus two pop buster. Oh, he rage quits his seed. And it's over. Moro is your Jad's Guilty Gear Stride third annual fighting game tournament champion. Yeah, that was three. That was three, Moro. You won. You won. You won. Congratulations. Wow. Faust is dead. Remember to spam spam some crabs. Faust is dead. Good job. Anyway. The bandit has won the tournament. Hope everybody's happy. Anyway, I hope everybody enjoyed the Jet third annual Jad's Guilty Gear Strive Fighting Game Tournament Extravaganza. Uh, be sure to turn uh, tune in next time uh, to some unspecified time to when we're going to have the fourth annual Jad's Guilty Gear Strive Fighting Game Tournament. Um, hope everybody... Uh, great job running and com commentating. Thank you. And, and make sure... Uh, to thank our sponsor, Publix, go to this, go there today and get your first Publix chicken tender sub if you've never had one. They are great. Also, thanks to our other sponsor, Water. Make sure you drink at least 17 gallons of water per day. Um. Anyway, take care, everybody. Are you ready? Wait, are we actually gonna do this? I, I'm gonna be real. I'm I'm washed up. I haven't played this game in a while. Bug finals. This is the Akuma final boss. Hope, hope everybody enjoys listening to my button clicks because they're pretty loud. Duel one. Let's rock. <laughs> Man, imagine playing Leo. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I'm washed up. Yeah, uh, Le Leo had some trouble getting in, so they had to buff it back then a little bit. Had to buff it a little bit. Just a little bit. What are we doing? First to three? First to three for the final final Akuma final boss challenge? Are you ready? The Akuma final boss challenge, <laughs> Leo. <laughs> yeah, this is, your, this is your celebration for winning. Is getting Leo'd. Sorry. Let's rock. 
<laughs> the crap. <laughs> the prize. Oh no, he grabbed it. Oh my god. Oh no. It begins. Oh no. Oh no. Can't even live commentate over his terrible caster? That's true. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna press Leo buttons. Okay, basketball. I do not know wall break. Okay, anyway. So yeah, uh first to three, correct? First to three. One more. One more. Bro. <laughs> Bro. Let's not go. <laughs> Let's not go. Flowchart gaming. It's true. See, the thing is. I can't have no. What do you got, no, Jack? Oh no. Are we gonna get lyrics? Are we getting lyrics? Almost. Duel one. Let's rock. Oh, chart gaming. Don't press buns there, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Leo had trouble getting in, okay? He had trouble getting in. Oh. See, what I tried to do there is I've been playing too much Street Fighter V. <laughs> it's my it's minus bro. I swear it is. Yeah. So anyway, I hope everybody enjoyed the Jad's Guilty Gear Strive Fighting Game Tournament. Um so, so yeah. So yeah.